Okay, I swear I'm here, I swear. I swear. <laughs> Hi everyone! Good morning! Good morning! Is everything ready? I think everything's ready! I hope everything's ready! Ugh. Oh! Later, yeah, later my own party, oh my goodness! Am I live? Yeah! Hi guys! Happy birthday! <laughs> I guess it should be you that I'm saying happy birthday! Happy birthday! You can't get to me right now because there's something in the way. But happy birthday, Susie! Hello, everyone! How are we doing? Good morning, Swaffle. Good morning, Lost. Good morning, Harmer. Good morning, Rug. Rooks. Bram! How are you doing, Haley? How are we doing? We are back with Udi today. This stream is sponsored by Udi. Uh, and the reason that I'm five minutes late to my own party is because. <laughs> The item of which we are sponsored by Udi, lovely, lovely, uh, Udi is lovely sponsored us for, it came 10 minutes before the stream. <laughs> so, oh, I know you're very happy about it, but sweetie, I need to give it to you. You can't have it just yet, love. She is already, she wants it. Come on, let's show everybody. Yeah? Good girl. Yes, good job. Let's show everyone. What do we have? Then you're going to have to put your foot out. She wants it. Look at this little face. <laughs> I need to give it to you. The whole point is that we do a gift gig, gift giving, Suze. You can't just take it. That's not what happens on Christmas. You don't. Santa doesn't come into the house and you immediately take your gifts from him. She's gone. She's gotten upset. We are sponsored by Udi today <laughs> for Udi's range of pet beds. What a perfect sponsor for the little angel baby's birthday, eh? We are sponsored by Udi. For their range of pet beds, this pet bag is that is as big as I am, and um, hopefully it's set up correctly because I literally had ten minutes to set it up before stream. So I'm hoping anything, anything that's not set up correctly, I will fix after stream. Um, yeah, it's yeah. So use the code Captain Badgertel at checkout. You can get money off your pet beds from Udi. Also, money off your Udis from Udi as well. Why am I here and not in dog cam? Dog cam is specially birthdayified, but I thought we'd moved to dog cam after I'd showed off the bed in all of its glory, and I didn't want to give it to her straight away. I wanted her to be excited for it. Right, you ready? Ooh. Oh Lord, hello doggy. It's so large. <laughs> she is a large lady. So we needed the large pepper. There are avocados and toast! It's, it is so heavy as well! It is so large! Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, don't... <laughs> like, Mother, can I have it yet? Can I have it, Mother? So I have checked and Code Captain Badgertail gets... Good morning, Badger. You should get that strange growth coming out of your head looked at. Must be what happens when you fail to recognize the regality of King Russell. Oh, something about a lot of months subbed and happy birthday to the Papa of the hour, the Tower of Power, too sweet to be sour. Avocados are the best. Is that better? Am I, Mike, Mike good? We good? Are we alright? <laughs> Are we still mute or are we alright? Yeah, we're alright, okay. <laughs> I was like, please, not today! Paragon, thank you so much for 70 months. Thank you! You can now legally drive in the UK and I hope you're very excited. You're very excited to get your first driver's license. Paragon, thank you so much. I smell really bad because this is... This is, um... This pipette is very nice. It's very weighty. It is, um... It's, it's just, it's very lovely. And of course, we are sponsored today by Udi. So thank you very much, Udi, for continuing to sponsor me because I love you, Udi. I love you. I love wearing my Udi. And <laughs> I'm really grateful it's now cold enough for me to wear said Udi. Yeah, so I checked the code and you should be able to get £35, €35 Euro or $35 at checkout off your pet beds or off your Udis um, using code Captain Badgertail. 
which is a pretty good discount. It's pretty, pretty, it's pretty, pretty nice. <laughs> Sweltering heat <laughs> during the summer's posh wankers of depression. <laughs> you just described my life, Paragon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Paul, good morning. How are you doing? Oh, and Digits, good morning. Oh my goodness. And um, what else did I have to say? That's something I wanted to tell you guys. Rug! Rug, thank you so much for giving us some to Omeraid! Thank you so very much, Rug. Omeraid, welcome to the weenies! Thank you very, very much, Rug. Thank you. Happy 12 months. Happy birthday, Suzu. Happy Look at that! <gasps> Kate, you're like... Your birthday now match your stream birthday now matches with Susan's birthday. Cake Diggity, thank you so much for 12 months. Thank you so much for using your prime on me for 12 months. Thank you so so much. And I'm so glad to have you back for Monday and Friday after uh, Dragon Age is finished. And I'm looking forward to uh looking forward to hearing about your playthrough. Have you started you have started. No, you haven't. Have you started Dragon Age yet? I know you picked it up during the sale. My cat refuses any bed that we buy her. So Suzu is relegated currently to blankets on the floor. Uh, she does have a nice bed, but she chooses not to use it because we're up here, so she chooses to sleep on the blankets. But very recently, because it is now cold enough for me to wear my Udi, and this is a true story, this isn't... Udi hasn't asked me to say this, and I've been saving this story now because I knew I was doing this stream. Um, it's now cold enough for me to wear it. Swaffle! Swaffle, thank you so much! Thank you so much for resolving! Goodness, what age are you at now? How old are you? How old are you? Can you can you do, have you got any milestones? Where are you? Is it 28 months? 28 months? Oh here you are! 28 months! Boy. You are a big boy! 28 months! I don't think you can do anything more at 28 than you could at 27, but you're now two months away from 30. Two months away from being the wrong side of 30. So oh, thank you so much, thank you. Thank you. It's all downhill from here, yeah. <laughs> the grace that the gray hairs will start uh, start sprouting. Yeah, so I now it's now cold enough for me to wear my Udi. So I've been wearing my Udi as the birthday girl. Yeah. Rug, thank you so much for giving us up to Hunter. Hunter, welcome to the weenies. To the weenies. You're in the cult now. You're in the real cult. 28 months. Almost old enough for ultra porn. Great. I don't need to know anymore, Loss. I don't need to know anymore. Thank you very much for the beauties. Pudgy Pet Beds are the perfect sponsor for this channel. Next stop, Hellman's. Next stop, Hellman's. Can you imagine if Heinz approached me? And they were like, you have to, you have to redact everything you said about Hellman's. You have to redact that Hellman's is your favorite, and we'll give you two hundred billion pounds. Would I do it? I'd have to think about it, wouldn't I? <laughs> yeah, I'm now cold enough to wear my Udi. So, little Gremlin is obsessed with me in my Udi. Like she'll see me wearing it because she likes the material, which is convenient because this is what this is made out of. She loves the material, so. As soon as I sit down on the floor, she's there. Rug, thank you so much for gifting some to Chad. Chad, Chad welcome to the weenies. Happy welcome birthday. to the weenies. Joe, Joe, thank you so much. Thank you very much for the 200 pities. The GLaDOS did that in the wrong order, but she tried. Thank you so much. Yeah, for 200 billion pounds, which is worth, what, like $3 right now? Yeah, so if I sit on the floor with my Udi on, she comes up to me and she's immediately all over me. She's just, she's obsessed with this Udi. And she, um, if I cross my legs, I create like this Udi hammock for her. And she, this is the only time she's ever done like lapdog stuff. She came and she laid out on my entire lap. And this is the only ever like... So I just knew. I I just I knew that this was like this is gonna be her um, her favorite thing in the world because she's so uncomfortable because um, she refuses to sleep on sleep on a, like any bed that isn't up here. 
So she shuffles around, so she's gonna be so, so overjoyed with the, like, the same fabric. Does Suzu like avocado? She likes food. She just, she... This reminds, because it's like avocado and toast, it reminded me of the sandwich she stole. <laughs> reminds me of the sandwich she stole. Oh yeah! It is really, it is really cozy, isn't it, Rooks? Really cozy. Minority smells because I try, I'm, it's like slightly too warm to be wearing it. But I wear it anyway, so I sweat in it. So I... <laughs> yeah, she is. She wants it. She wants it. But you can't, you don't get to a party and immediately get the gift. Suzo, I've got a schedule to keep. I've written, I've written down a schedule of when you're getting this. <laughs> no. <laughs> and you know, thank you so much for giving us some of Heinz mayonnaise. Very much. Hi, Heinz. Your mayonnaise is okay. It's just not as good as helmets. I prefer your ketchup. Your ketchup's great. And rug. Thank you very much for giving us up to Podo. Thank you. And rug. We do actually have a game to play today after gifts. So we today the plan is food. So much we've got cake. We have um, treats. We have we're gonna do this or that. Hey, doggy, thank you, Anonymous. Thank you for giving us some the birthday dog. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, she, um, we've got this or that, so I've got lots of different treats, so she has to pick one or the other. Um, we've got uh, presents for her as well. Uh, she's got a snuffle mat that she's going to have on stream. Uh, and we've got something to do with her presents. Uh, yeah. And then we've got a game. We do have a game. It is kind of a dog-related computer game. So it's actually one that Rog suggested, which is why it reminded me. Um, it's called Toilet Chronicles. And I feel like that really evokes the fact that she <sighs> didn't quite make it to the toilet last night. Rog, Rog, thank you so much for giving us up to Alex. Thank you very much, Rog. Alex, welcome to the weenies. Welcome back. She is two today. Yeah, she's two years old. She's two years old. Yeah, so um, she didn't quite make it to the bathroom last night at 3 a.m. Didn't quite make it. Made it pretty close. Didn't make it nonetheless. And that was uh, Greg at 3 a.m. Cleaning that up. <laughs> I threw a ball for my dog the other day. Dog. Over the top, I know, but she looked great in a tax store. Oh, my God. Oh, thank you so much. <gasps> Oh, we should have thrown a ball for her. Thank you so much, Otto. Thank you. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, so uh, Greg was uh, Greg was down there cleaning B up. <laughs> ah, it's fine. It's, it's fine. You know, little accidents happen. She's only two. You know, you, I bet you peed yourselves when you were two as well. It's the fact that she, uh, she did come in. She woke us up. And then ran down the stairs, to which I'm like, okay, she needs the toilet. Greg, go take her to the toilet. And um, <laughs> Greg watches her go into the living room. Doesn't, and he's like, oh, I thought she was gonna get in her, get in her bed. And then she pees, and I'm like, no, she, she never needs to go into her bed, Greg. Just take her to pee. <laughs> she tricks you. She does. She was making her bed. Look, she tricks you, Greg. She tricks you. She makes you think she's doing something else, but she's not. Asia Wind! Shit myself in two years old, it's fine. See? See, it happens. It happens, Sticky. Oh, she's watching me. She's got her peepers out. Look at those peepers. Damn, I shit myself as an adult. I peed myself as an adult. Yeah, I'm doing okay, Otter. I'm doing okay. This, um, so our spots for today's Udi. And this came 10 minutes before the stream started. So I was there, I could see on the uh, shipping notification that it was coming today. And I was shocking the window, because I thought I, if, if it doesn't come in time, we're gonna have to belay it until um, after I holiday. I pee myself as an adult, just a little. You know, sometimes you laugh too hard, right, Loss? Sometimes it happens when you laugh too hard and it just happens to the best of us. It also happens to the worst of us too. Uh, sometimes get tickled too much, just pee, just pee, you know. It's like a defense mechanism, right? get whoever is tickling me off of me. Yeah, so I was uh, I was sitting looking at the looking out the window. I was like, when's it coming? When's it coming? And I see the delivery man. And I'm like, Greg, it's here. <laughs> it's here, Greg. <laughs> so we're trying to, we put it together because it doesn't come, uh, it doesn't come completely assembled. So we're there putting it together like 10 minutes. <laughs> we 
which is why I was two minutes late. Yeah, yeah. Had taste of all my fluids. <laughs> hey, I would not even. Oh, you're having a job interview. <gasps> no. No. Are you waiting for them to call you? Can you call them? Sometimes the wind changes mid peeing. What? And it just flies off against the wall. Right, do you think I've made a? Do you think I've made a wait long enough? What do you think, Greg? Do you think she's waited long enough? I'm enjoying having this on my lap, personally. It's like, it's very, very nice and soft. It's very nice and soft. Okay. Happy Friday. Thank you very much. She isn't sad. She always looks like that. She always looks like that. Don't worry. She always just has an aura. Aura about her. And we do have um, exclamation mark Udi as well in chat. Um, where you can be taken to Udi, and if you check out the link, um, it'll help me out. It'll show Udi that that you enjoy enjoy the streams and that you enjoy them sponsoring me. <laughs> Thank you, Udi. Thank you. Yeah, I'm really, really pleased that um, we keep getting sponsored by a company I genuinely like. You know, it's um, it's it's you know, I couldn't ask for more, could I? <laughs> Thank you for that badger. No worry, Alex. I like to try and create kind of a facility or a cult um, for everyone to share everything. Susie's about to get boosted as well. Oh, look at that boost train. It's better than how she usually boosts herself. <laughs> My body. <laughs> so I was sitting in the bedroom and the window was a little bit open and uh, I could hear her outside. I could hear her just farting. I could just hear <laughs> Give her her presents! Oh, Susie! Susie! Yeah, do you want some presents? Yeah? Last Lost. one. Good night for now. Loss, you have a wonderful nap, alright? You have a lovely nap. Thank you so much, Loss. Thank you. Yes, you do! Come on then! Hang on. I'm gonna take off my headphones for a moment. Just because I think this will be. You ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Suzy. Happy birthday to you. I think she's. Oh, I'm gonna cry. That's a good girl.
I'm crying. <laughs> oh, it's ridiculous. I'm ridiculous. I'm so stupid. It doesn't, I don't know. I just... I like seeing her happy, you know? Oh, she's falling asleep. I just like seeing her happy. So glad that she can be happy. <laughs> oh, I'm such a weedie. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, dear. Udi did not ask me to cry, just to <laughs> be really clear. This was not one of their requests. <laughs> Dog stream is just gonna be her sleeping in a comfy new bed the whole time. I have like games for her planned and stuff. Oh dear, let's just watch Suzu sleep, yeah. It is very comfy. It is it is very uh very cozy. So I think I could sleep in it. I think I could. Oh, it's very warm, and the like the fabric is oody fabric, so it's really like a uh, fleecy, fleecy. Tune in every Friday for a Suzu sleep and stream. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, Suzu, please. No. Suzu, this is a sponsored stream. Please. <laughs> what? <laughs> She's so cozy. <laughs> I'm hoping it's pretty easy. It, it's uh, pretty easy to deconstruct. So. And my Udi has been fairly easy to clean. I've been able to. Um, been able to get out all the mayo mayo um, mayo stains quite easily. Hey, Papa Meow Meow. Good morning. Good blessed Friday. Isn't she just a baby? Yeah. Dog, 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 dog. Toast. Thank you so much, Toast. Thank you. Yeah, I got a sense of the bomb. You know, it's just uh, just for her privacy. <laughs> Thank you very much, Papa. Oof. Papa, don't preach. Meow, 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 meow. You like it? Yeah, she is pretty calm. She's used to it now. She's used to it. Should see her at 3 a.m. needing to pee, though. Definitely not calm. Oh, Jeff, thank you. Oh, oh, I'm so happy. I'm just such a weenie. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, Susie, go give him a sub. Oh, Anonymous. Thank you so much for gifting Susie a sub. Susie. Yeah. You're going to enjoy your emotes. She says thank you. <laughs> As you can see, her mouth definitely moved. And she said thank you. And she said she's going to enjoy... Which emote is she going to enjoy the most? I think she's going to enjoy CBT Goblin the best. <laughs> oh. I suppose this is as, as kind of a good as time as any to give you like an update on her, right? You guys want a little bit of a Suzu update? I don't know. She can talk. She can. She's a very advanced doggy. So... Little Angel Baby is Angel Baby 90% of the time. I would 100% Leary, 100%. Yeah, she's 90% 90, 90 of the time she's a sweet Angel Baby. 10% of the time she's a 
She is not a sweet angel baby. She's <laughs> a little bit satanic. Uh, no, she's... She, um... Oh, she's asleep. So we had our friends um, over to look after her for when I was at EGX, and we sent them, like, a list of to-do. It was, you know, when to give her food and everything, and she's got a little bit of problem with food aggression. So, yeah, she's a little bit of a devil adult. Yeah, exactly. She's got a, she's got a little bit of a problem with food aggression, which is understandable, considering she was a stray. So I get it. You know, I get it. Um, you don't want anyone to take your food away. And it's, I don't think she does it deliberately to us. It's just almost like she doesn't see us. Because she's absolutely fine with us handling her food. But then she almost, she goes, yeah. Yeah, it's resource guarding, mum. Look. <laughs> I don't like it when you growl at me, right? I'm just... <laughs> yeah, so uh, it's like she doesn't see us. It's like she gets some kind of flashback. Some kind of fucking war flashback or something. And uh, she just she'll she'll growl if she thinks she'll try to take it away, which when you know we're not. Um, so we're we're trying to really work on that. We're uh, trying to we're now hand feeding her all of her meals. Yeah, we are, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> She's like, I hate it. <laughs> I hate it because it's slower. So we're now hand feeding all of her meals. Uh, and hopefully that will solve the problem because we don't want to take our food away. We just want to be able to, you know, if she was eating something dangerous, be able to take it away or, you know, so it doesn't escalate into we can't even go in the same room with her. But on the, um, the, on the like document that I sent them saying like what to do at all the times, it's like, don't, don't be in the same room with her while she was eating. And she was fine. She didn't. She didn't even act up. She didn't even act up because I didn't want them to get. I didn't want to get them the the shit end of the stick at all. But she, she was a sweet angel baby. It was like we'd been lying all this time. And uh, what are your other problems? Oh yeah, with the little accident we had last night. It's a bit of a problem, but it's okay. Um, it's okay. We're working. We're working on that, aren't we? And then what are your other problems? We want to get her a little bit more so a little bit socialized uh, a bit better with other dogs she's a she's a little bit nervous around dogs that don't look like her so she's really good with long snouted sock puppet dogs but she's not super good with dogs that don't look like her or dogs that are a bit she's very introverted so she's not very good with extroverts which you know i personally i personally get you know i also identify with that <laughs> No, she just, she just likes, she, it's because she's a greyhound and, you know, she's been brought up around other greyhounds <laughs> and she's probably never met a different dog before, so she, she just needs to get used to them. <laughs> she just needs to get used to, she just needs to get used to them, eh, Brandon? Yeah, she is, she's a little bit afraid of, um, yeah. Yeah, she is a little bit afraid of certain dogs as well. Which isn't great, um, but yeah, she's yeah, she's she's getting there, aren't you? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yeah, so uh, we're getting there with that, and um, yeah. Other than that, she's such a sweet angel baby. She started like sitting on me. She fucking loves the udi. She chases me around for that. Um, she gets really excited at meal times now. So she she waggy 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 waggy. Um, yeah, she's very, um, very sweet. That is an absolute crackhead like my dogs. You'd miss them, though, wouldn't you? You'd miss them. If your dog wasn't... If, if you woke up tomorrow and your dogs were sweet angel babies, you'd miss them, right? You'd miss it. I don't have any pets. She should get a, get a greyhound. <laughs> should I get a greyhound? <laughs> I'm doing good, Brandon. Yeah, I'm doing good. Yeah, sweet angel baby's birthday, so I couldn't, I couldn't complain. She's uh, she's very very excitable by food. Um, she is getting used to car rides now, so she's doing really well with that. Before we had a, we had a lot of trouble with cars. Uh, she was very afraid of cars, very afraid of traffic. 
but she now gets in the car kind of with a bit of a bribe, but mostly fine. Um, Doggo isn't doing any tricks! The trick is sleeping. Her trick is sleeping. Her, tr her trick is to show her off how nice our sponsor's bed is. Udi. Love you, Udi. <laughs> That's the trick. That's the trick. I, I have a special command. Um, it's Udi. And she knows what she's supposed to do. She's brewing a fart for a magical surprise. <laughs> she knows exactly what to do. I say, Suzu, sponsor. And she... Look, you saw, you saw that. Chill my firewood pile, which I mulch down. <laughs> He's just helping you mulch it. <laughs> They're just helping you mulch it, Ramscallion. Oh. She, uh, she doesn't, she's not massive chewer. She did ba bang her head on our coffee table and got angry at the coffee table. <laughs> She got angry that it would have the gall to be there where she could bang her head. And um, she she bit it. Do I even have a foot? Oh, damn. How old is she? She is two. She's just turning two. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do you know where they are? They're right there. Does Greg have any? I thought that's what I could hear. Hang on a moment. One moment, give me a moment. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Let me switch to this camera. No, don't look at that. That one. Just one moment. Sorry, I swapped I swapped cameras because the cupboard is right behind Sue's, so I thought no one would want to see me trying to uh, shove my body through a letterbox. So I, I'm well, I mean, I'm sure somebody would, but <laughs> I'd want them to see. Yeah, I, thank you, Greg. Thank you. There we go. That's the somebody. Um, <laughs> Rug, is this for you? Is this for you? I think you deserve a fortune cookie. She's a uh, two JD. She's turning two. I'm you. You're her little baby. She's a little baby. So it's something we would enjoy clipping. That's why. I, that's why I swap screens. What would I do if I was taking Susie for a walk in the park and then a ghost appeared and Susie jumped into my arms in fear? I, no, I'd say Jinkies. I'd say Jinkies Scoob. <laughs> I'd say Jinkies Scoob. The firewood dog. Her name is Catherine. Oh, oh my gosh, she's a dog called Cat. Only walks in straight lines. If the other dog is in her way, she just walks under them instead of around. What kind of dog is she? It's for Suzu! Oh, rug! You big sweetie. Right, Susie. <laughs> oh, this is great, rug! It says, go treat yourself tomorrow. Oh... Well, I guess we'll have to we'll have to take her out for a treat then. I guess we'll have to take her out for a treat. That's a perfect one for a dog. Is this a moment? Oh, it should have been a moment. No, I would. The cake will be the moment. <laughs> but do you want to finish the fortune cookie? Oh, in Bulgaria! I was feeling left out, Bulgaria. How are you doing today? Lab pit mix. Oh, butterscotch. Ah. Oh, Rose Callan, you should get one of those dog DNA tests. I've been thinking about doing one for her. I know she's a greyhound, but I, I, that's just so, I'm just so, what if, what if she was like a husky? You know, what if she had a bit of husky in her and we didn't know? <laughs> yeah. Okay, Bulgaria. Beauty is in the... <laughs> So this one's a little bit, I, I don't know whether this one's a little bit of an insult, to be honest. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder. I think, I think what this fortune cookie means then is that you need to behold 
those air fried donuts to see the beauty in them. That's what I, I think it's... That's what I think it's saying to you. Rather than, rather than it being rude. It does seem like it might be being a bit rude. I'm all out. I'm all out. You have to save yourself, Haley. You have to save yourself for not next Monday, but the Monday after. Or not this Monday, but the Monday after. Needs a treat tomorrow after all this hard work testing Udi Pepe's. Ah, you could, she's already tired. She's already fallen asleep at her post. No, she's uh, she's pretty uh, pretty stupid. <laughs> like I can say walk, walk, walkies. Oh, I think she would respond to anything that I said. Like, let her relax again. Poopies. Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't need to be. It doesn't need to be anything particular. I would not even. Oh, you call the company. No one asked the phone. Maybe the Rakura is sick. I hope they've got diarrhea. <laughs> that a mean thing to say? I know, you know what, I hope they've got, uh, not diarrhea, I hope they have a soft enough stool that it, it is disconcerting. That's what I hope. Hey Zach, good morning. Good morning. One day I'm gonna make and eat air fried donuts and <laughs> what are we gonna talk about? Your experience of air fried donuts, that's what we're gonna talk about. Oh! I want to get my cats to get used to being outside. <gasps> oh, yeah, you can get a uh, harness as well. My sister had harnesses for their cat. Um, they didn't mind them. They were pretty good. <laughs> oh, I sent my dog's DNA to a company, and this is what happened. Videos exactly. I could get content out of it. As well. <laughs> exactly. I saw my parents. Um, I saw my parents yesterday. Uh, they're doing fine, by the way. Uh, they seem much better. Um, and I saw their cat. They got a little cat. And it was... It's so strange because she's such a large lady. It was... Their cat seems so tiny. Oh, yeah. Of course, Digis. Of course. I said, Greg, look. Things are getting a bit stale on the Captain Badger... <laughs> Twitch.tv slash Captain Badgertail channel. How are we going to spice it up? Mmm... So we've done the more poop stories. I think we're just gonna have to get a dog now. Just, uh, just in case anyone's wondering. No, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. Um, I've always, um, I've always wanted a dog, and this is a big, uh, big dream come true. A big dream come true. I think it is. A lot different than I thought it would be, is it? Yeah, yeah, I think it's different than I thought it would be, but it is absolutely one of my almost like my life goals fulfilled. I feel very um I feel very lucky to have had her. My cat Mochi loves going outside. She's currently mad at me because I won't let her go out in the hurricane. Oh, what a silly sausage. What a silly sausage. Kitty cats. Oh, she's got no she's got no idea. Like treats, food, cheese, sausages, banana. Bananas are our favorite. I hope everybody is uh, everybody is doing okay in the hurricane areas. I hope you are staying safe, staying inside. I know they they happen all too often, but I hope you guys are hope you guys are warm and you know no no cats are going outside in there. Indoor cats, I love being outdoors, obviously, so I want to at least try take them for walks and stuff, probably get an Encolo stroller for them. I've seen lots of people taking their cats on um, adventures. I uh, see it a lot on Instagram, it's very, very cute. It's like the unicorn costume! Thank you very much! <laughs> Thank you very much! Hey, drunk! <laughs> oh, drunk, you can thank today's sponsor, Udi! <laughs> For the wonderful, warm, cozy, and very, very, very loved bed. Thank you, Rinse. Thank you. Hey, Susie. Happy birthday. She says thank you. She says thank you. 
He was angry his wife didn't come visit him that day because of the Hey, <laughs> <Oi>, drunk! <laughs> yeah. Drunk. You suited up. Oh, dear. My real name is Ian and I apologise for the in inclement weather I am currently providing. I love that they called it Hurricane Ian. I... I just... I... I... That's one thing I really love about hurricanes. Is that... Is that okay to say? So the one thing I really love about hurricanes is that they call them human names. It's the same as when someone calls their dog a really human name like Kevin or Ian. Like, you know, a name that you wouldn't use for a dog or a... I just, I just, I, you know, oh. It's a bit windy today. Yeah, it's just Ian, you know? It's just, it's Ian. Oh, drunk. I've got the same, I've got the same one as you. I have, I've got the panda one as well. We match. It's just gotten cool enough for me to start wearing it. And, um... This little weenie has been sitting on it. So whenever whenever I sit on the floor with it on, she sits on me. So she's been absolutely obsessed. So it was, re <laughs> it was really fortuitous. <laughs> it's very fortuitous. Uh... Is there a snail, Udi? There might be a snail, Udi. I don't know. You can't, you can check, if you exclamation mark Udi, you can check out to see whether there's a snail one. <laughs> oh dear, twin him with the best of them from Canulus to Udi. Now all you need is a camera up your butt and you'll have <laughs> the extra twinning. Hurricane Badger. Strongest hurricane you ever did see. <laughs> Thank you very much, Anonymous. Someone water skiing down the middle of her street. Oh my god! I can't wait for her to spread the smear food all over that bed. I hope she does it on the toast areas because then at least it looks like it's part of the design. <laughs> oh, I'm drunk! Oh, no. oh! What are you up to? What's up? Who's it? Excuse me, birthday lady. <laughs> oh boy, I hope Suzu's snuffle mat gets bought somewhere I can get it. Oh boy, I don't have Suzu's snuffle mat that I'm gonna have to, that I want to give her soon. I hope it gets bought within my arm's reach so I can give it to her. Oh boy, I wish there was a a husband to give me said this right there. Where? Or was it in what you? You've got it. Have you got it? Have you got it? Show me the good Greg. <laughs> Hurricane Mad Dog. Quite scary and exciting every year at this time. Will Greg appear on the screen? I don't think I've got, I've cl I've got only got a small box with me in it. Hurricane Badger will be a shitstorm. You know, uh, well, do you remember when Venice flooded? Do you remember? Doesn't it happen often? Do you remember when it, everybody was walking around in like that big, like almost like the fisherman's overalls? What are you doing, man? All right, I'm gonna snuff my first birthday meal of the day. Oh, birthday meal. Pizza pie, that's the more. That's the more. Come on, in you bed. Good 
Oh yeah. Yes, she is! Hang on, let me move. No, oh, Suzu, don't eat me! No! No! <laughs> this is a this is a snuffle mat, so you put the treats inside the like fabric. <laughs> you put it inside the fabric so she has to use her nose and her mouth to kind of snuffle. To snuffle through the little fabric pieces and find the food and dig it out so it's a little bit uh, mentally stimulating for her <laughs> he's a good girl yeah Brody did you get it Amazon right yeah yeah <laughs> it's uh, it's pretty good she does get a bit angry at it sometimes and she will pull out. So I decided to do it difficult. You know, I decided to make it difficult for her. Because uh, I was like, oh, this is too easy. And uh, I decided to tie them together. But she just got a bit angry at them. Uh, and just... <laughs> she, she does that when she gets a bit annoyed at it. Giving her a fake cake to trick her. <laughs> no, I do have a real cake. She's uh, distracted. Yeah, it's like a little puzzle for Dougie. Uh, probably be able to see it better at my head. It's a little little muffin, little muffin. I didn't want to get her a giant cake because I was like, she's not gonna eat it. You know, she's not gonna be able to eat the whole giant cake. So I got her a little muffin so she can kind of handheld maybe eat it at my hand. It's got a icing and a little um, little uh, Tritos on top and a. Little, little thing with a dog on it. So hopefully, hopefully she'll like it. Uh, just to be, so I've made sure to replace it with food confusion. Exactly. I didn't make it myself. I did. I did purchase. I did purchase it. Uh, just to be, just in case anyone thinks I'm overfeeding her. Uh, we did lower what she was eating this morning, so she wasn't getting overfed. And uh, you know, it's her birthday, so it's not too bad. We don't feed her like this every day. Hey, Wanisu. Good morning. Looks like something after my kids have got a little psycho on it. Hey, Bob! Good morning, what? What is this? Or what is that? <laughs> Look at her go. She's a smart lady. No wonder she looks so sad when she first came in. I gave her less, uh, so she, eat lunch, she eats lunch at one. Uh, so we gave her a little bit less food for lunch. Or a, a twelve fifty. She eats it. Okay. Where's Susie's party hat? I did actually get one for her. Um. Okay. All right. So it's over there. I just didn't think that it that didn't think she'd be willing to have it on her head. Happy birthday, Susie. Hope you're having a wonderful day. <laughs> to Mary, thank you so much. I love how like. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I love GLaDOS. Thank you so much, Tenarian. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the 500 bitties. Thank you. She never believes that she's finished all the food either. She'll sit there for an age. Happy Doggy. She's a very happy lady. A very, very cozy, very happy lady. Yeah? Oh. Snack. I could just watch her for hours. So the other activities that I've got, um, did I trim her nails? We do trim her nails. So they came to, they came, <laughs> she came to us with quite long nails. So we've been trying to, uh, the more you cut them, the kind of shorter you can get them. Cause it seemed like no one had cut her nails in quite a while. So they are quite long, but that's as short as we can get them right now. So we're just trying to, Trying to, you know, um, keep them keep them fairly short. And those don't lie, there's still food. I'm sure there's like the tiniest crumb that she wants to get. Oh, Tetsu, have a birthday from me and Peach. Peach says she hopes she has a good birthday and doesn't feel too wolf tomorrow. I did consider getting her some dog wine. And I was like, nah, you know, that might be a bit much. She'll just sh spill that. <laughs> She'll spill that everywhere. Gladys is 50% sarcastic, 50% threading. 100 and 100% sassy. 
Yeah, you need them to recede a bit. So we've just been trying to do it regularly. Oh god, cats. Cats are... Cats are little demon creatures when it comes to cutting their nails, though. She doesn't mind. We just give her a treat every time we... Like, so, clip, treat, clip, treat, clip, treat. And she, she quite enjoys having them done now. Yeah. Does Suzu sleep with her? <laughs> she does roach. She does, but she has a bit of a hard time balancing on her back. Like, oh, must check for, must check for any residual snacks. Any snacks left? Oh, I smell something. I smell something rather delicious. Oh, therefore she needed the bed to do it. So our cats used to be outside cats. Um, so they would rub their nails down naturally. So it wasn't too big, too big of an issue. They tolerated the vest says my cats are some of the most well behaved. Really? Have you ever had your cats groomed or anything? She used to click, click, click on the floor. She was walking around the floor. Oh, she does the little tippy tappy pitter patter. Oh, Breed. Happy Breed. birthday, Suzu. Hope you get all the treats you could ask or Twilber love. Oh, she looked at you, Breed. <laughs> So much, Bree. Thank you so much for the thousand biddies. Thank you so much, for the kind words. Thank you, thank you. She's gonna get more treats than she could ever ask for, than she could ever wish for. Hey. Yeah, you will, will you? So our itinerary today is um, we're gonna do a bit of this and that. So I have a. looking at me. I've got a cart. You guys can't see. Can't see. It's got snacks in it. So we're gonna hold each snack out in our hand. Yeah? It's got snacks in it, hasn't it? We're gonna hold the snacks out in our hand and she's gotta pick this or that. So does she want a piece of banana or does she want a slice of orange, you know, and she's got she's got to make the decision about which one she'll prefer. They just yell about it. They're like, "Hey, hey, <laughs> fucking Candace!" Oh my god, yeah, we can do predictions. Hama, you're a better streamer than me. We can do predictions to see which one she'll take. That's actually that is that is a very very good idea, Hama. That's very good. <laughs> I will be doing that. And then after this or that, <laughs> we will give her her cake. We will give her her presents. And um, we'll have her do something with her present as well. And don't forget, we do have a game as well. So if she finishes her snuffle mat, we'll do, um, we'll do a bit of game before we start this or that. <laughs> oh, the one she picks decides what you're doing. That's actually clever. That's actually really clever, Tetsu. Now it's just which one she wants to eat first, and then she can have the other one. <laughs> it's her birthday. I couldn't. I couldn't show her both and not let her have both. Oh, little Cherish required several staff members to trim her claws, as she was not particularly tolerant cat when it came to going to the vet. The vet liked you, didn't he, Suze? Yeah. Yeah. Stephen, bonjour! Happy Sunday, Stephen. Snacks instead of snacks. I just, I think she's so stupid. I don't think she'll ever understand. <laughs> so she's, she's reasonably smart with learning commands. But she is so stupid. That I just don't think she'll ever get a hang of, ever get a hold of it. Burn <laughs> Hates the vet. She's a spicy tortoise shell. That's why she's called Candace. <laughs> Sweaty little paw prints on the vet's table because he was frightened. My cat used to do the same. I can take away your snuffle mat if you want. No, mother. No, it's mine. No, I will investigate for crumbs later. <sighs> right. Let's, uh, why don't we play a little bit of our game? Hang on. Let me move us into, move us into the correct. 
correct category. Tories are the most assholes of cats. I don't know, I find um Ginger cats have always been the biggest assholes. Pop on the game screen. <laughs> I'll stick doggy up here. How does that work out for everyone? You know, birthday girls still gotta be gotta be right there. Do you like the uh, little happy birthday banner as well? I put it right next to her so she could see it as well, so she would know it was her birthday. <gasps> Maine Coon! And she's just her absolute assholes. Both in cat form and in human form. So I thought the most appropriate game that we could play for Susie's birthday, um, especially considering she had a little accident last night, a little accident is uh, the Toilet Chronicles. It also seemed really, really appropriate considering the story I told on Wednesday of my first, or Tuesday, was it Tuesday or Wednesday, of my first experience in a public toilet. I just think that this is, you know, it just doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't get any better than this. The most perfect game because we have had truly the Toilet Chronicles with Suzu, um, yeah. Oh, she's so sleepy. She loves it. Yeah, are you? I never see her like she never looks this comfortable usually. So she never looks this cozy. She never looks this kind of like snuggly. I'm gonna cry again. This is actually a rug suggested game as well. I don't like. I don't like that. I don't- I don't like that! Oh, no! What is this horror game, Rug? Why did you suggest this to me? <laughs> Are we getting ready for fucking Spooktober already? You're in a bathroom at a 2008 party. What is this? Bud Light? Pepsi Light. Beps Pepsi Light. Dr. Shepper. That was a crushed can. I belong in the trap. Is this scary? What? Try F. <gasps> you killed yourself. Now the mysteries of this place. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, the <laughs> I'm not stupid enough to try that again. Instantly tries it again. I am scared, Brent. I am terrified. I've been put in this toilet. I don't know what. My cat's in the Discord. Tori lady. Puff. 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 How do I pronounce that drug? How am I? How am I pronouncing that? Who fixed it? Oh, <gasps> someone fixed it. This is odd. Pfeffer news. Pfeffer news. <laughs> yeah, so that's the end of the gaming portion of our stream. Attempt three. Goodness. Try F. <laughs> what is this? Fanta? Banter. You, your ad could be here. <laughs> what? We could put a Captain Badger tail. <laughs> How 
How do urinals work? Do you flush urinals or does, does, does gravity kind of do its work? Also, like, what's the point? What's the point of these? What are we, what are we, what are, what are these little, uh, what are these achieving? What are these little separators achieving? Because they're not hiding anything. Who's a good birthday girl? Ooja booja booja. Oh, she's dead asleep. Yeah, because, like, I'm just thinking... I'm thinking of Todge. I'm thinking, you know, you're standing here and then Todge is out. I just... I, I feel like this isn't covering anything. Because, like, okay. I'm standing here. I'm using this urinal. If I look, I can see the full urinal. Are we in the gents? <laughs> oh, Squidward. Sounds important. If you have an idea for this poster, leave a comment in the community discussion. <laughs> Chad! Yes, we've already had first birthday, but what about second birthday? Chad! Thank you so much! We've got to have 11 Z's, Chad, which is convenient because you're 11 months old now. Chad, thank you so much. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. Out of order. Let me in! Let me in! Looks like someone's in there. Can I crouch? No. Oh, you can't peek at other stores off from this angle! I can't be stopped! Yes, very Stanley Parable it is. You got crossed by a tentacle, now the mysteries of this place will never be solved. Am I gonna just get every ending? This is a fucking speed run. This is... it feels like a bathroom horror game if I'm honest. Let's do what I think it wants me to do, which is go in this room. We care about our customers would poop here again. Me after I go to the public toilet. Okay. That's that's good toilet paper. That's good toilet paper. Why are they throwing that away? Anything else? Like you can't just throw perfectly good toilet paper away. Hey buddy, any chance you got some um Toilet paper? Because this shit is empty over here, partner. Oh, I... Can I hold his hand? Oh, I hate my legs! Too bad I can't read. Press C to cry. It is me in a public toilet. It's me at EGX. <laughs> Guys, stop crying! That's not for you! We've got a flush, right? Not animals. I don't see anyone in that stall. Do you? I don't see anyone. What well, badger would be a peeper? Yeah, maybe they had archer's legs. Maybe we're just 100% leg people, you know? <laughs> so 
Susie just let out a nasty fart. Don't show them. Wet it. Don't show them what? What? What is that? Wake him? Make him leave. It's her birthday, she's allowed a fart. We are also in a bathroom, so I guess fair enough. From administrative. Cue to make it look at you. Oh, fun. Okay. Oh my god, it's. You see, like, it's like a. Like a mirror to the. I don't know. Strange. Like a. You can jump if I press space. Oh, there's something in that toilet. No idea what I'm doing. Press Q to play pay respects. Maybe I can try and peep again. Oh, I hate this. nightmares about um about toilets this is my this is what i dream of get it together i think i took too long This is like, these are my nightmares about toilet, like. Hey bud, any chance you got some, um, toilet paper? Cause this shit is empty over here, partner. Can I give him, like, something? Um, uh, is that what I think it is? Scrub your bum with it! I'll give him... Bin toilet paper. Yeah. He is incredibly happy. Don't leave. Put it in the bin. All right, get him to leave, it said. She's having the best time. She's gotten her new bed. Goodness. Bro. She's gotten her new bed. She's abs having absolutely the best time. I say she leaves. Maybe I do. Does he want more toilet paper? He did want more toilet paper. Why does he need just endless amounts of toilet paper? Get out! I don't have that much toilet paper! I'm running out! say don't show them
What? What bread? What? What am I? What am I missing? What does the picture look like? It looks like the sink area, doesn't it? Oh, right. I see. I see. Oh. There you go. They are. They watching. Wait, who took my picture? That was rude. Oh my god, someone took a picture of my bum. Two. Where's one? Oh my god, I know what I want to do. No, I want to take a picture of you. Did I get a picture of them? Where did my picture go? Are they just getting loads of pictures of themselves? What? Oh. Hello. Can I show you a picture of my dad on the toilet? Exactly what? Did that just say? Kill him. God, they don't give you long, do they? Jesus Christ! Give me the grenade. Right click to pull the ring. Ah! <laughs> How was I supposed to know? How was I supposed to know it would... <laughs> it would go off so quickly! <laughs> How long do you usually get on a grenade? I don't know. I never, you, are, you are always a grenade, Badger. Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, yeah, you know, you're right, you're right. I use grenades every Saturday, right? Oh, hello. Hello, Doggy. Hi. You thinking you want something? What time is it? Hmm? Mrs. It's not time for yours. She knows her snacks. Go on, go to bed. Go to bed. Go on. Back to your bed. It's not time for snackies yet. She's like, excuse me, it's my birthday. I can decide when I want snackies. Go on. Go to bed. Like I can smell that you have banana. Mother, can I have, please, please give me the banana. Go on. Go back to your bed. Give me a, give me the banana, mother. <laughs> Nothing. Dad, there's nothing there, Sus. No! Hey, Craig, happy fucking Fart and Friday. Craig, how are you doing? How are you doing? See, your longness brings other people joy, Sus. Little sock puppet, that's why. How can I with dare withstand? Withhold snacks from that adorable face. Oh, it's hard. It's hard, isn't it? Yeah! Yeah, you're a birthday lady, aren't you? Birthday lady. Do you want to put your hat on? She's not gonna. She's probably not gonna leave it on. Come here. Come here. Come here. You can't go back to your bed now. Oh my goodness. Come here. Easy. Wait. Yeah. There's a good girl. Oh, is it your birthday? <laughs> your birthday hat on. Oh no, it fell off. Oh no, no birthday hat for you. Is it your birthday? <laughs> it's your birthday, isn't it? Yeah. Is a good girl. Don't take it. <laughs> go on. Go on, you can go sit back in your bed now. Go on. Go back to your bed. You get more snacks in a minute. You get more snacks in a minute. I know I've got a banana here that you really want to eat, but you can have it later. You have it in a minute. 
Eu amo. Nada. Nada give me the banana. Don't withhold snacks from me, mother. Oh dear, I pressed restart, that's fine. Yo one. Is she a lap dog? Um so she started sitting on me when I um when I had my Udi on. But she is not that is the that's the that basically that's the way that she sits on me. She won't usually sit on me. It's the power of the Udi, which is what makes the bed so amazing? Such a good lady. Brought to you by Udi. Sponsored by Udi today. So X much more Udi in chat to get your own dog Humans bed, Udi. Are so weird. They spend all their time hiding in the place where the waste human fool goes. Instead of testing, knock, knock, knock. <laughs> time for more testing. Knock, knock, knock. <laughs> Thank you so much, Pixels. <laughs> Thank you. Knock, knock. Time for more testing. Oh, I didn't lock the door. That makes sense. And uh, don't forget you can use code Captain Badgertail at checkout for some money off an hoodie or. A dog bed hoodie now as well, hey, buddy, which is pretty, has, pretty um, good, pretty over dang here. cool. Because this shit is empty over here, partner. I think, um, I think that got taken out, Saint. I saw, I saw there was some um, uh, comments about that on the, on uh, the reviews for it. Oh, dear. and uh, somebody, somebody said they'd taken it out. Sorry for last time, now it's fixed. Who fixed it? Yeah, it was a few months ago. I think uh, I think they took it out when people realized, which is, you know, don't don't know how I don't know how don't think I feel don't think I feel great about that, but it's good they took it off. Did I make this game? Yeah, this is a, um, where's the thing that says to get it wet? This is literally my nightmare. Like, I have genuine nightmares about toilets and getting stuck in toilets and, like, having to poop in public. Oh, dear. So this is like, this is genuinely like a real nightmare for me. Did I get one? Maybe there's not enough, um... Maybe there's not enough, uh, what's it called? Uh, filming it. Where's the notice that... Isn't there usually a thing that says check the... There we go. Says, uh, the cake is a lie! Oh my goodness! Look at that! Kill him. Okay, right click. You killed your partner! Now the mysteries of this place will never be solved! It's the guy of me! I, you said kill him! So I did! Am I not sp- God, I hate that it accounts my attempts. This feels rude. Oh, I haven't locked it. Hey, buddy. Any chance you got some, um... 
toilet paper? Because this shit is empty over here. Yeah, I always do what the toilet paper tells me to. How I always know how to wipe properly. Oh, Mrs. Dad told a story from when he was in the army and doing grenade training exercise. He pulled the pin and he was about to throw it and his drill sergeant came over and started yelling him, <gasps> No! He'd obviously panicked and told him to throw it and they had to die for cover. Because he thought he hadn't pulled it and he came over to tell him to pull it. No! That's ridiculous. I presume they both, like, they were both okay, right? Yeah, go ahead, Haley. Go ahead. The ways to die. So many the ways to die. Why did you kill that person in the public toilet? The toilet paper told me to. Thank you very much, Alien! She's a very, very lucky lady. A very happy lady. If you can't trust the notes, then maybe you should do the opposite of what the notes say. Maybe, I, yeah, maybe, you know what? Maybe I should, um... Try and kill the person in the other. Hey, buddy. Any chance you got some, um... You know, maybe I should put the grenade over the toilet paper wall, you know, rather than giving it to my friend. Get very quick at this bit. Very speedy. Oh. That needs. Thank you. I turned around for that one. Does it make a difference? Yeah. No, it does not make a difference. It belongs in the trash, but like, do you think that means the grenade belongs in the trash? I belong in the trash. Like the other trash can. Or the little, maybe the squidward? <gasps> Five! Belongs in the trash. Five what? Five what? Five is for later. Did turn around. Did you get it? Just pretend there is a hole and enter the void. Should I enter the void? I mean, I guess I don't have a choice. There's nothing else to do. Case of emergency for yellow doors only. Take care of him. Oh, no. Hello. Oh, he has 
He's got no trousers on. How nice. He's got he's got no trousers. He can sit in there though. Who fixed it? Who fixed what? Private fly pile was here. Staff only. Ladies. Okay, okay, we're in the ladies. I've. Oh, nine. The worst toilet in school. <laughs> you died from cringe. Oh, number 69. For goodness sake. Oh, I get it. Why the. Ah! No! Come on! You've got to be kidding me! You've got to be kidding me! Ten. Try a ten. All right, we'll try one more time, and then we'll give dog, they'll give doggy her, give her, give her a bit of a, a treato. I'm ready. What a badger way to go. The ways to die. There's a disease called toilet fever. The first symptom is feeling quite flushed. Hey, buddy. Any chance Pretty crappy way to go. Could you use the screwdriver on the vent? Oh my god, really, bread. Oh, bread, you're a genius. There we go. I want to go into the... Oh my god, you're kidding me! Right, let's give the dog some treats. You, you're kidding! <laughs> silly game. What a silly game! Right. What treats should we give the <laughs> me. Pause that. We'll give Doggy some treats now. <laughs> da ways to die! We will come back to Toilet Chronicles, don't worry. But we will give Doggy some treats. So, we have chicken with broccoli and sweet potato sticks. What was that? I, I tripped on some ban I tripped on a banana rain. I tripped on a banana. We have some succulent pigs in blankets, so very festive. We've got some bite-sized chicken bites. We've got a banana. And we've got an orange as well. She'll only get one segment of orange. So I thought maybe we would put... Maybe the music's got loud. Maybe we would put her... Treats up against one another and then we'll do the bananas at Zuma. Because I think, like, I think these are going to be... Dory, she won't eat the, she won't eat the peel. She'll just eat the, uh... Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> No one will be slipping on any banana peels here. So we will go for... She does like oranges. She really likes oranges. I think banana's gonna win. But we will pit everything. Kind of... We'll do like... Do rounds. So why don't we go for sausage versus... Chicken? Sausage versus chicken? Brass. Happy dog day. Brass, thank you so much! Thank you so much for 10 months. And Frass, how are you feeling after yesterday? How are you feeling after the spookums yesterday? I was there. As soon as the uh, community, like, you know, 
put your channel points in. I was like, yep, 2,000 points, play it again. Play it again. Let's, uh, we're doing predictions. And she will eat both of these things, but it's which will she go for first? She'll go for obviously the one that she prefers. So we will do a round with chicken versus sausage. Look at them legs. Yes, she got long legs. Slept really well, Mo. Really? You clearly weren't scared enough for us. You clearly need a clearly need to play a scarier game. You need to up the ante. Okay, let's put it on for two minutes. You get to pick whether Dogie will prefer chicken or sausage. Put your points in. Every doggo has its day, and today. It's Suzu's. Happy <laughs> birthday, best dog. Oh, Pixels, thank you. Thank you so much. What a, what a little baby. She's so, so happy. Thank you. I saw I saw the uh, trombone champ after the calm the hell down. Seemed to do the trick. Just nightmares about trombones chasing you across a, um, across a space station. <laughs> Imagine the little mannequins playing on the trombones. Yeah, look at the special that you've dumped it! Honestly, I can't recommend it enough. Like, having... Having felt it... Like, it's really nice. Like, genuinely really lovely bed. So I... I full wholeheartedly recommend anybody who's looking for a new dog bed for their dog. It's, 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 re it's really lovely. It's really good quality. Um, it's so cozy and so soft. And just... Like, I've never seen her this comfortable in my office. I'm in an Udi right now. Oh, what did I, did you get the pretzel one? I think I saw I think I saw you posting it. If you want to be as comfy as the Suzu and Fress, do check out Udi. Going through the link does help a lot. Shows Udi that you you like you like me being sponsored by them. And uh, you can use code Captain Bad to tell at checkout if you want to get yourself anything. Do it. Do it. So I will give sausage is bigger than chicken. So we got chicken, sausage. You got the sausage one! The XT got the Nickelodeon one. Oh, of course you got the sausage one. Of course you did. I got the panda one because it was the closest um, closest to a badger. I was as close as it could get. Distant cousins. Okay, what did you guys think it was going to be? I, I think it's going to be sausage, but she does, so she prefers chicken to sausage, but I reckon in her mind she's going to be like, this is better than this. This is much smaller. The bear, the, the badges of the bear world. Exactly. Let me see what you guys voted. So 60% of you said chicken, 40% said sausage. Sausage is the underdog. I think she's going to pick sausage. I'm going to have to wake her up. Good morning, lovely. Good morning, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. 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 Good! Puppy! Went for sausage! Sausage! Team Sausage takes it! Team Sausage! I'm shocked. I'm... Team Sausage. I. She seemed more excited than the chicken when I let her smell it. Well, she picks both. She's gotta pick one or the other to go to first. Good girl! Here you go, guys. You got sausage! I'm... I can take the snuffle man away. Yeah. I'll shove it outside in a sec. Right. And then I suppose we'll do... Okay, so this is a chicken and broccoli and sweet potato stick. So it looks like this. We'll just section off a bit. She does, does really enjoy these. And let's 
Do chicken and vegetables versus chicken by itself. And we'll see which of those she prefers, and then we will pit the winner against the sausages. She looks so tired. I think she's just really enjoying it. <laughs> I think he's put her to sleep. Which did Doggy prefer? Uh, chicken or chicken with veggies? Okay, so this is again the same chicken that she just she just decided she wanted sausage over with like putting being put against putting it against the chicken and the vegetables she does really really enjoy these chicken vegetable strips so I'll let that I'll let that possibly possibly you can take that into account and then we'll put the winner against the sausage and see which one of these treats she prefers overall and then we'll do the big these are her, like, favourites. She really loves fruit. She's really into fruit. <laughs> so I think, regardless, these would be the ones that she picked over the treats. Yeah, the Greyhounds sleep about 16 hours a day, typically. So, yeah, she's, uh, she sleeps, she sleeps a lot. <laughs> she's a sleepy lady. They do have bread. Ready, you ready to be covered in garlic? The citrus surprised me for some reason. Apparently they can eat lemons, but I didn't want to... <laughs> I didn't... I felt... It felt mean being like, here's a lemon, Suzu. I know she's not going to like it, you know? Yes, uh, Greyhound Sleeper for around 16 hours a day. She is quite young. Obviously, she's only two. So she sleeps a little bit less than that. I wish I knew which the two was smellier. This one's smellier. The chicken with vegetables is smellier. Parties are exhausting, yeah. It's hard when you're such a party princess, isn't it? <laughs> it's hard. It's just so difficult being the center of attention all the time, isn't it? Yeah. We do have some gifts for her as well. Not yet. I'm not. She's excited. She's like, are you here to give me treats? We've got some little... Little party gifts for her. Yeah, if you've got some presents. I bet on pure chicken. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Really? Oh, I've got my microphone. I'll be able to hear me a bit better. Are you ready? Hello. Oh, you glad to Oh, she's dribbled everywhere, guys. This is soaking wet. Ready? Ella? Eight? Hello? Good girl. Huh? Okay. <laughs> Eight? Thank you. Did a good job. Chicken! Chicken one! It's a good girl. You can have this one as well in a minute. Chicken with veggies lost as well. Right! So, shall we see? Yeah, go. Shall we see which one she prefers? I thought you really know that she she likes the the sausages best. Then we have the chicken. Then we have the chicken and vegetables. Oh, if I am I holding them outside of cam, Greg? Oh dang, sorry, sorry guys. Suzu, get back into your bed. <laughs> get back into your bed, you big stinky. Go on, go on. Bit on the edge, okay. Hey, Suzu, bed. Bed. Such an idiot, she thinks this. Your bed, get your bed. Come on, I know you're so cruel. Bed. Good girl. Good job. Yes. Yeah. 
Okay. Yeah, she literally has the biggest zoomies. She is like vibrating with excitement. Wait. Good girl. Should we do a uh, chicken with veggies versus sausage to see whether she's really uh, just a contrary human being? Or not, she's not a human being. Sausage. Sausage or chicken with veggies? Remember that sausage did win with the just normal chicken. So we're doing chicken and veggies versus the sausage that we had before. See whether she just, maybe she just likes variety. Maybe she's like variety is the spice of life. Yeah, she's got the chatters. Yeah, look at those little peepers. We'll pick a, we'll pick a slightly smaller sausage so she's not overeating. So we have chicken and veggies. Your veggies. Sausage. And remember the sausage did win, took the took the number one spot. But she might just be a lady who likes a little bit of spice. You know, she likes a little bit of difference. I wonder if I can break the sausages in half. Okay. I can more them. <laughs> Look at how she's beeping me! She's like, have you got snacks? <laughs> hi! Hi! Is it, have you known that this is the snack place? Hi, sweetheart! She goes for the same hand every time, do you think? No, I think she picked different ones last time. Leave it. Not yours yet. No, yours. He's a good girl. Yeah. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Yeah. Love you lots. Oh, she's drooling. <laughs> she's a big drooly baby, aren't you? She's not here for a fuss. She's just here to see if I'll give her any snacks early. Wiggle wiggle! Wiggle wiggle wiggle! Hey! Wiggle wiggle wiggle! Wiggle wiggle wiggle! Wiggle wiggle! Wiggle 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 wiggle! Wiggle 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 wiggle! Wiggle wiggle! Doop a doop a doop boop! I can relate <laughs> Okay, big drooly baby. Come on. It's the ultimate showdown. Come on! Wiggle wiggle wiggle! It's even less visible now. No, you could see. You could see I was just in the corner. I was right there. I made sure I even checked. We got sausage now. Sausage is the ultimate winner, which I'm a little bit shocked at because we tell everyone, uh, we, you saw it this time. Good, I'm glad, I'm glad. Oh, now I want seven. I'm just so glad that we get to, I don't know. I just, having a dog has been, oh no, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna, I don't want to start sobbing before the end of the stream. <laughs> we can have our sobby time at the end of the stream, because I can already feel my lies welling up. Oh, my desk is gonna be so sticky. Yeah. Gonna have a little cry. She's two. She's two now, Paragon. She's a little baby. <laughs> Made a nice chunk of beans. Better spend them wholly on dog, dog cam. 
Right, now we have the, like, gen... Ultimate, ultimate. I don't know, actually, you know what? We'll, out of the winners of these, we'll also put this against the sausage. It's gonna be eating too many sausages, probably. That's something I'll have to deal with later. <laughs> what fruit does Doggy prefer? She loves both of these fruits. Um, this is a... I'll just put orange. It's a Satsuma, but I don't have spell. Satsuma. She loves both of these fruits a lot. Bananas are what we use to get her to uh, do things that we need her to do, though. So, like, get in the car, get past some cows or something. I'm sitting there. I was sitting there like, get through the gate! <laughs> She got stuck, there was a gate and there were some cows on the other side of the gate and she didn't want to walk through the gate because obviously there's loads of cows. And it was like I was, I had a hold them up. I was like, Susan, get through the gate. Yeah, so she has an orange and she will get a bit of the banana. She won't get be getting the whole thing. Um, Just a bit of the banana. So slice of orange versus like chunk of banana. <gasps> Anon Sama, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome, welcome in. Welcome, welcome into the dog food stream. I think, I, you know what, I'm not going to bias this one. You guys can decide what you think you're going to like best. I won't, um, won't bias this one. I can eat these ones. The Satsuma is pretty good though. If that biases it at all. Orange. Oh, Ibrax is so sure that you've already preemptively spent your beans on orange color. Orange will be the underdog from what you told us. Quite possibly, yeah. Mm-hmm. The dog bed is big enough for her to roach out on. It's big enough to her to really, like, spread because she really loves, like, she loves to grunt around she like to get the perfect uh perfect position and roll around and um yeah she can smell it because you see that smelling to the air she smells she can smell so um having more space is always good for her i'd be very surprised at orange i would be probably a bit surprised as well 10k on whichever i think will win how many beans you made bread i believe in orange so when it comes to... So, traditionally she prefers banana. I can say this because the prediction is closing. Um, traditionally she prefers banana. But, whenever you're peeling an orange, she does get very excited. She starts to chatter. She starts to smell the air. Won twice and lost once. So, you've come out with 10k. I'm like, oh no, don't drop my orange. I see. Yeah, you know you're getting more snackies. Okay, you ready? trying to snatch that banana I didn't even need to like offer it to her and she was trying to snatch it it's Suzu Fress uh S-U-Z-U -U. like a little Susie little Susie you could go big sweetie thank you very much Loss oh Fress <laughs> Fress when are you getting a dog when are you getting specifically a greyhound? Just... 
Banana took it. It's fair enough. She does like banana quite a lot. They are favorites. Right. Do we want banana versus sausage? When indeed, yes! Because you know, um... Land, um... But, but la landlord, landlords can't legally say you can't have a pet anymore. Without a good reason. So I presume they could say, oh... <laughs> the reason is blah 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 blah. Um... But... Yeah, I'm trying to be a bit conservative about how much banana I give, I don't really Greg. Ah, ah, ah. She, I know, she's... I bet she's gonna... Oh, no. I know this It's the new Tennessee outline, I don't think it's law law. It says it on the government webpage, though. And that's what I... That's what I take as law. <laughs> Yeah, the, they could they could say like, oh, we just put brand new carpets in or something, or oh, you have to pay more rent for a dog or something. <laughs> yeah, no harm in asking. Yeah, no harm in asking. Think about think about having just look at this little sock puppet. Leave it. Leave it. There's so much food. So much. Let's start a prediction. Which did Doggy prefer? Sausage or ba na ba na? Which did Doggy prefer? Sausage or banana? I think we know, but... I think we know, but perhaps, you know, it's sometimes worth just putting points into these to, you know, you never know, you might win big. Hey! <laughs> She's sitting on the floor, like, can I have it yet? <laughs> yeah? And then maybe it's time, maybe it's time to open some presents afterwards, eh? I've actually got your cake down for three, but I think you might need a little bit of a break from snacks. Might eat you. Yeah. Might need to have a little bit of a break from snacks, but we can open some presents afterwards. Yes. Oh yeah, she did uh, She did pee at 3am. Brass. Not to where she was meant to pee. In fact, where she wasn't meant to pee. I do I do blame Greg though. I do blame Greg uh, for not... You've got... Like, you, she tricks you. You've, you've always got to be sussy. If she... If, if she goes somewhere, just let her out to pee. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if she's just peed. It doesn't matter... If she couldn't, you know, she hasn't drunk in like an hour, and she can't possibly need to pee. It does not matter if she looks like she's getting into her bed, making her bed. It doesn't matter. If she goes somewhere, she might need to pee, and it's just worth taking her out. <laughs> I blame Greg for that one. Yeah? Yeah, but Daddy's fault, right? She agrees. Yeah, not your fault. Daddy's fault. Yeah, okay. What are you guys picking? Banana, yeah. Gotta go with the sauce, but I'm ready to lose. <laughs> Sussy sauce. She's a good girl. She's literally vibrating. Yeah, and then we'll do some presents, eh? Yeah, you've already had your big present, though. Right. Come on. You gotta go over your bed. I'm not giving them to you on the floor. gonna have a big poop later don't worry i've been trying not to give her the um the other one that she doesn't take 
so she hopefully doesn't eat it, you know, overeat. She's a banana girl. You gotta respect it. She just, she loves fruit. She just loves it. But she absolutely cannot get enough of banana. She just, she will do anything for a banana. Like, glitch, like, anything that she's afraid of. Like, it, it doesn't matter how crippling afraid she is of it. If there is a banana to get her to do it, she will do it. Right, you want to open some presents now? Yes? She's like, no, I want to eat that banana. I can see you've got the rest of that banana there. Just, just give it to me, mom. I might just take these, uh, I might take the banana to, um, to Greg. Give Greg the banana, right? Um, just so, just so we don't have a banana fever. <laughs> yeah, Greg, get ready for some banana. Get ready for some trash. Get ready for all oh, my trash, Greg. Trash. 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 You might need to keep some. Mm -hmm. Here's a good go. Here's a good go. We do keep some treats so we can keep uh, keep bribing her. <laughs> for banana was Greg, wasn't it? Well, yeah. couldn't say anything about the size of Greg's banana. Greg slap 40k in that one! Right, you guys see me? You see me? See my hands? Oh, let me get present. Thank you. It's your birthday. Birthday lady! Hey, birthday lady? Yeah. Yeah, birthday lady. What do you want first? Do you want this bag? Hmm? Well, it's got no treats in it. It doesn't have any treats. Ooh! What's this? <laughs> oh! Wow! <laughs> Ooh! Do you want It's an educational. So you put the you put the treat in here, and then you put all the flippers over, and she has to move the flipper out the way. So move the flipper out the way, then move the treat box here, drop the treat, and then move it. So she's got to use her brain. <laughs> Just give me the treat. Yeah, so we, we try to find one that wouldn't break, is... Because <laughs> I know someone's going to be quite fervently trying to get the treats. So we can do this a bit later as well. I'll have her, um... Don't tell her, I'm oh, sorry, shh. You guys won't tell her, right? You keep it secret, just between us. Are right, you ready for your next gift? Right? Okay. Oh, what's this? Is it a little pumpkin outfit? Yeah? Put it on. Good Little pumpkin outfit. Look at the little pumpkin. Oh, alright. 
the last and best gift. Oh, who is this? Who is this? <laughs> Ooh, yes, it's Russell. Yes, it's the girl. <laughs> yes, the girl. Did you kill him? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, the girl. Yes. <laughs> so I apologize to you guys who now have to listen to that for the rest of the stream. I'm training her to if Russell comes back. Now Russell won't Russell won't last long now if he comes back. Bite him in the butt. Oh, Fras. Go get yourself a donut, all right? I will see you soon. Thank you. No, thank you so, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for coming to her party. Thank you. You already broken him? Nope, she has not broken him. So she's quite uh, she's she likes squeakers, so she tends to break them. I couldn't get a sweater on, and I'm not now. Uh, now I'm not gonna try and get it on. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, kimchi! Happy birthday, Papa! Kimchi, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, she died herself fast. <laughs> She's like, I am exhausted now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Equality Star, thank you so much for resubbing as well. Thank you for continuing on the gift sub. Thank you so much. Welcome back to the weenies. Thank you, thank you. Oh, she's so sleepy now. Wait, look, it's hard work taking down a king, right? It's hard work taking down a member of the royal family. Yeah, you like all your presents. Yeah, rat murder is tiresome work, right? Yeah, you happy? Do you mind if I show chat the rat, uh, the, um, the rat? Do you mind if I take it? Like he's farting now. <laughs> she, it's good that when she, when she actually gets to Russell, she'll be a she, she's well prepared. So this is our little Russell. Oh, pro! Oh, no, you're Ronard. Pro, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? Russell is pretty cute. She'll still she'll still enjoy playing with him. And um, sometimes you can get the squeakers working again. Sometimes she just breaks them and you can get it get it squeaking again. Um, if you move around the parts, but I think she might have actually killed this one. So, we actually have some rat facts that came with this rat. Um, <laughs> rats are known for their furry bodies and super long tails. They're one of the most reproductive animals in the world and can reproduce every three weeks. That's one reason why there are more rats than humans in the world. Billions more, in fact. 
They are extremely social animals that live in communities looking after each other by grooming, sleeping, and playing together. That's why rats make great pets. She's like, mother, give me back my rat. <laughs> Do you want it back? You want it back? Let me put your jumper on. Get too hot though. Good girl. Good girl, yes! Good job, yes! Good girl. Let me give you back your rat in a second. Um. The Sumerian bamboo rat can go large as a, grow as large as a small cat. Oh, she's having a tantrum now. She's like, it's my birthday, give it back. They love to be around people and would treat you part as one of the as part of the pack. Rats teeth never stop growing and can grow up to five inches per year. They are cuddly by nature. Very cute. Here's a rat fact for you, Susan loves to kill them. Susan loves to just... When you're right back. Right, let me take it back for her. Oh, high fever, stuffed nose, loose bowels. No, pro. Three days tops. I've got all of my fingers crossed for you. All of them crossed. Oh, no. Not only have you got like the, like kind of the cold like symptoms, but you've also got the shits. Can you eat? Can you taste anything? Mom, it's already dead. No need to touch it anymore. <laughs> There's a good girl. A two T. We have not finished Toilet Chronicles. We will go back to Toilet Chronicles. Um, after after a little bit of playing Toilet Chronicles, we will have Doggy Cake. So you did not miss Doggy Cake yet. We will um, go back to Doggy Cake, and I will give her her new puzzle box to solve as well, with uh, with some of the treats in it. There's a weird dog on your dog. Nah, nah, it's just Russell. That's just, he lives there, you know. She's such a happy lady now. She's been so spoiled. <laughs> such a happy lady. <laughs> You're ridiculous, don't you? You're so silly. <laughs> Anonymous, thank you so much for gifting us up to King Russell the Great. <laughs> ah, come on, it's King Russell the Worst. It has a dog on its butt. Oh, such a good lady. Such oh, she's such a oh, such a happy lady. Some guy. Some King guy. Was framed. <laughs> yeah, framed as a specimen. It's framed as a no taxidermy. <laughs> Some guy, thank you so much. Thank you so much for 10 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How are you doing today? It's been a, I feel like it's been a while since I've seen you. No crying yet. No crying, keep it together. Oh, Reed. Reed, thank you so much for giving us up to Susan. Thank you. Hey, baby. Yeah, you got a sub. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, <laughs> No, I don't cry yet. I won't cry yet. I swear. My store is 35 years. <gasps> Duh! Yes, big congratulations! For well, she's a jolly good Susa sings note. For she's a jolly good Susa sings note. For she's a jolly good Susa sings note. Sings that note. Only Russell could any king. Thank you, Rogue! Rogue, thank you so much! 
Yeah, you're a jolly good Susie. I will do a, uh, I'll do a moment when um, the cake comes out. Happy birthday, Suzu. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. And Darth, I really do, like, I wish, I, I hope, I hope for you that there is a 36th anniversary. I hope you take, don't, like, take it easy. Don't, try not to, try not to stress yourself over it. Try not, I know that's so easy to say. I just don't stress about it. Because, like, whenever I, so whenever I'm really upset, Greg's like, oh, are you doing everything you tell everyone else to do? Like, you know, when I'm like, oh, if you're having a bad day, take it easy, take a drink, relax. I don't, I don't, I, this is like, I, I lie. I don't do any of that when I'm, <laughs> when I'm any of those things. <laughs> Red, what time are you going? How long, how long have you got until you're going? Can I borrow Greg for a bit? I need a life, good life coach. I'm sorry, I'm a full-time job loss. <laughs> I'm literally, I'm a full-time, I'm a full-time job. Oh, God, she's falling asleep with that bloody rat on her head. I thought she would take it off. I'm surprised, I'm surprised Greg gets anything done these days. <laughs> surprised he gets anything done. All right, you guys ready for some more toilet time? Now the rat is her friend. No, no. Do you think maybe I'm conditioning her to have that rat as a friend? So she won't actually kill Russell now. Leaving in half an hour, I'll be watching on my phone while there. Okay. When will I do cake? Um... Mm, I thought I'd do maybe cake at like four. So that is 40 minutes time from now. Um, yeah, four, maybe half three. I don't know. We'll see how Toilet Chronicles go. We have Toilet Chronicles. Yeah. Well, is it quite a quick drive, Fred? <gasps> Nick! Nick, how are you doing? Yeah, we got Toilet Chronicles. <laughs> we got something Suzu is really, really good at. Having Toilet Chronicles, like a whole, just wait till I'm in <laughs> Right, right, right. I'll uh, as soon as you say you're leaving, I'll immediately do the moment. I'll I'll do it the second you say that you've left, so that <laughs> she is very spoiled. I feel very um, I don't know. I feel very emotional, and I'm trying to really suck it in until I don't want to cry until I give her a birthday cake at least. Because then it's like only an hour of me crying. It's not me crying on and off. I've already cried once. I feel very emotional about, I don't know, just what a, a special lady she is and how, like, oh, it's, it's like, oh, Lord, they're coming. Oh, Lord, the tears are coming. How, like, special she's been treated. And as I say, as I'm sitting on the toilet, um, we have locked the door. Happy birthday, Suzu. I love the stuffed Russell. Edley, thank you! I, I thought of you guys. I saw it when I was out. And I was like, whoa, we could, there is nothing better to give her for her birthday than this, like, stuffed rat. It looks like the rat won. <laughs> it looks like, looks like the rat defeated her, doesn't it? It does. Nick, this reminds me of um, pooping at EGX. <laughs> That's why I've picked this game. It's marking its territory. This is like, this is my dog now. See, I was pretty sure this was gonna be the... Let's see, look, eight. So I'm guessing, is there no way to pick this up? No, it's not. Oh. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Is there like a, a clear, whether this is red, is it the color of the writing? Because if this is red, then that's eight. Eight. 
it was so much fun. It was like, I started, I tried to poop before I left, and then I literally started, started driving and immediately needed to shit. Just like, in, immediate. Uh, oh, there's, I think five is pink. Uh, five is pink. How did that rat go on Susie's head? Did she put it there with the music both from pause? Yes, she definitely did. <laughs> no, I put it, I put it there. Uh, what they wanted me to do. And then I need to get the... Did I have something for him? Oh! There it is. There we go. Oh, dip. So slippy. Oh my god. Axe is usually this sticky or slippery, not sticky, the opposite of sticky. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for giving us up to Nick. Nick! Welcome to the weenies! Right click to get gnomed. I got. Fuck, you mean I got gnomed? This is my dog's birthday, they can't know me. It's illegal! Oh, Lord. This was eight, wasn't it? Eight and then five. Looks like a good place for DLC. Okay. <laughs> oh shit. This body sucks. Oh, nine is green. There we go. I thought I had three. Watch out for the banana, don't worry, Susan will eat it. Right, different, need more. Cabby, thank you! Thank you, Cabby! She's the world's best two year old now. Take care of him, right. Has he got a bum hole as well? Oh, he's got a poop coming out of his bum. Right. What do I do with this gnome? Like, you guys seem to know the gnome meme. Is there a gnome? What do, what do you do with the gnome after you've been gnomed? Uh, like, what do, I, what do I do with him? She's a little baby. She is a little baby. She's the sweetest baby. What does that even say? Yeah. Blow up the staff door? Oh, I, I'm gonna get gnomed. Yeah. I'm gonna get tricked again. You keep him for later. <laughs> what am I? He's just there making noise. He's in there. I don't quite understand. The turd coming out of that nose rectum. It happens to the best of us. Sometimes we have a bit more, a bit of seepage. Well, we haven't even spoken to our partner yet.
Hey, Bugs, any chance you got some um, toilet paper? I gave it to him. Because this shit is empty over here, partner. Oh. This does really remind me of Stanley Parable. See this one? Don't show them. What does that say? Take? Oh, take care of him. Does he want this? No. Does he want the gnome? Do you want the gnome? No, he does not want the gnome. Uh, I don't remember what this guy wanted. I've forgotten. Oh lord, I've forgotten. How you get rashes? Oh! This is a door? Do you think it's a yellow door? Oh, I thought maybe I'd have to... my bum smelled of coconut yeah i don't i don't act no you're right i don't super get i did i moved backwards i moved backwards i don't get the like why you need scented toilet paper i don't quite get the like who's who's sniffing down there right I can't remember how I'm supposed to get the camera. I'm not gifted enough to smell my own ass. What, you're saying you can't bend that way? guy not gonna ask me for toilet paper. Hey bud, you any chance you got some um, toilet paper? Cause this shit is empty over here, partner. Thanks. Right, then he gives me the thing. And uh, this is nine. Foxy. Happy 19 months. Happy fucking 19 months, Foxy! Thank you so much for 19 months. Holy shit. Such a fucking long time. Foxy, how are you doing today? Thank you so much. Oh! Check! What? What? Yeah, that, what? I hate this bloody banana peel. Yeah. There we go, we got the camera. And don't forget, I am just an ass with legs. Vent. We've already done the vent. And there's just a heckin' lot of toilet paper. We've got the gnome with the poo coming out of his ass. Let me put him here. Ladies' bathroom. Fucking hell. Fucking hell! It was at this moment in the toilets that the player contemplated their life choices <laughs> and their lack of body, and if they were just a pair of glorious gams and hands. Thank you so much, Arkane. Glorious gams in the hands. Jesus Christ. Ah. Oh. You have something for me? 
Didn't he want the telegram that said kill him? Maybe not. Do I have something for him? Like a... Got a grenade that the pin hasn't been pulled on. Do you want that? Yeah, it's not pin. Like, the pin hasn't been pulled. Which wall? I've already blown up one of the walls. Maybe there is a different wall to break, blow up. Maybe this one? This one looks sussy, right? He only wanted one thing so far. Or just keep giving him more and more toilet paper, Greg. How much, like, how much toilet paper did this one man need? I'm speed running this. This game is bananas. There's a number in the word loading. <gasps> what was it? Was it six? Yellow six. Was it yellow six? It was yellow six, wasn't it? Yellow six, yeah. You're right. Yellow six, pink five. Um, uh, green nine and then uh, red eight. This shit is bad. <laughs> B A N A N A S B bananas B A N A N A S Do you have something for me? Toilet paper. Toilet paper. Thanks. I think it was yellow. Thanks. I'm running out of toilet paper here. I thought there was some more toilet paper in this room, but I think. understand why he doesn't come out of the toilet though like if he really wanted to help me Thanks. he hadn't finished his other task what do you mean this one does he want this do you want a picture of me that's good oh, a blue two blue two here you go please don't do that again hmm? blue two So we just need yellow. Oh my god, are these different shades? Oh Jesus Christ. They're different they're different shades. One is yellow and one is orange like it's not really an orange, it's just a yellow. You know, different different shade of yellow. Okay. I'm stuck. No, I don't have anything for you! Stuck! Yellow was the loading screen. Was it? Was it not orange? Yellow. He bag is him. I'm presuming this isn't just. Yeah. We could brute force it. Why don't we just? Hmm. 
No. Four. Five. Nope. Six. Oh. I think it's the other yellow. Guys, I think it's... I think this is six. And this is... That! Clearly. That was... Do I go this way? Should I be going that way, sir? Yeah, I guess... I guess so. I guess. Exit. Sure, I believe that this is the exit. Oh. Oh, I hate this. Hello. Hi, this isn't... And that's all. You're back at the party. I'm back at the party. No, I'm not. This doesn't look like my party. Oh my god, where the fuck disappointed? am I? Sorry if you didn't get all the answers, but at least it was fun. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy Happy birthday, birthday dear Susan, oh, from I, the I missus to you. I think I owe you one more ending. Red, Here. thank you so much from you and the missus. You, was it all a dream? We haven't got ending 11 out of, or 12 out of 12. No, see, this isn't the ending. You can walk around if you want, and then just press Q when you're bored. They're lying to me. I just got my sixth mortgage. I sure hope nothing bad happens to the economy. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Just press Q when you're bored. This guy is crazy. He's planking. Maybe I should have brought my grenade with me. I've got your grenade for ya. Just press Q when you're bored. I remember planking. I remember seeing people posting pictures on Facebook of them planking. Just oh press my god, Q remember that? When you're bored. <laughs> it was an economy. I don't want to press Q. Do you think they'll say... I don't want to press Q. Just press Q when you're bored. Owling? What the fuck is owling? Alright, I'll press Q. The end. Was that it? No! We must have missed something. I'm gonna wait because there's no skip button. I don't believe that this is the end. And thank you for playing end of part one. Press Q if bored. Oh, and it just shuts the game down. How interesting. It's like, well, if you're bored, go play something else. Oh, just does it. Is when people would perch on things. And they would say, hey guys, I'm owling. It, it just reminds me of when people say that they're, they're what is it? They're go for, go for heading. <laughs> Suzuing is when you sleep with a rat on your head. What if my friend isn't in there? Hey buddy, any chance you got some um, toilet paper? Cause this shit is empty over here, brother. Snail. What would that be, Haley? What is gopher heading? Is that not what you call it? It's when you're so close to pooping that the poop is like nearly coming out. Isn't that what it's called? To mm, 
nine was green. Five was pink. Six and eight. Oh, wasn't it this one was six actually, and then it was We didn't find anything in the wind. We found the gnome! Do I need the gnome? Oh, prairie dogging! That's it. Let's take him. Um... And that's all. You're back at the party. No? The yellow number. Oh, yeah, yeah, we did find the yellow number. You're right. Are you disappointed? Yes, I'm disappointed. Sorry if you didn't get all the answers, but at least it was fun. I would like to play Q because I'm bored, please. Press Q. Oh, and I, I think I owe you one more ending. Yes, Here. give me one more ending. No. Is there something to do with the gnome? You can walk around if you want, and then just press Q when you're bored. Try taking what? Taking taking the gnome. Take care of him. Oh! Oh, Rog, I'm supposed to murder the gnome. It won't let me skip this bit. Or take or do I take him with me? Hey, Steve! Just press Q when you're bored. I pressed, I pressed Q. Okay. I'm so insistent. That we're getting this final ending. This is round number. I think it's actually three. Um, what was it? Pink. Pink was five. Green was nine. This was six. No, this was six. It was six. This was something else. And this was eight. Right. The vods aren't as funny though. What do you mean? My humor transcends D. No, I get what you mean. I get it, you. Meh. Okay, I've got the gnome. grenade then no it's poor no we haven't even thought of a name for our gnome what do you guys want to call him herbert yeah i'll take herbert Gno gnome lin on the six no yes i don't remember five eight Have I got one of the numbers wrong? 
Nine. Okay, I can't see anything. Bon Bonjour, happy birthday, Susu. Happy 10 month anniversary. What a great day to be a weenie CBT Wilbur Love CBT Goblin CBT Sniffer. Bananas. Oh, there he is! There and he is! That's all. You're back at the party. Bananas, thank you so much for 10 months. Holy shit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. She does like them. You disappointed? Sorry if you didn't get all you're the right. answers. You're right. You're right. At least it was fun. The. I. Oh, I don't I, understand. I think I owe you one more ending. Am Here. I fucking this up? Ah! We got the one with the gnome! You escaped with your partner. Was it all a dream? What's that room with the bedroom, then? You saw that. You all saw that, right? You can walk around if you want. And then just press Q when you're bored. You all saw the bedroom. Yeah. That's a gnome. Thank you very much, Yak. Me lady. And I haven't been able to get back to that bedroom. I want to see if we can get that bedroom one again. And then... Did you imagine the bedroom? Speed running. <laughs> Gonna try going the other direction. And we want to go to the left. Why does it keep taking me to the... It's not going to take me back to the bedroom and now, is it? That's all. You're back at the party. Pino! Thank you very much. Thank you, Pino. Thank you. It is Doki's birthday today. You're disappointed? I am disappointed. Sorry if you didn't get all what? the answers. But it does have tentacles, Pino. Weirdly enough, hang on, we're gonna tap out. I'm gonna what is this called? Toilet Chronicles. All endings. Bedroom ending. Toilet. The developer even asked the post asking how the room was found. Has it, like, is it not an actual ending then? Well, how did I find the bedroom? Yeah, 
Yeah, because I'm finding a lot of um, like bedroom, like it's coming up, but it's I'm not getting um. Does the bedroom mean that they're finally working on the new chapter, someone said? I don't know. Do not try and bend the bedroom, that's impossible. Instead, only try to realize the truth. There is no bedroom. A bedroom? Bedroom? Pixels? Bedroom? Yeah! Yeah, it had a squeaker, but she's immediately broken it, Banana. She's immediately... <laughs> what do you want to sticky? Hey? She's such a happy lady, aren't you? Such a happy lady. Yeah, I'm digital. I'm a digital athlete now. Cause like I search, I search Toilet Chronicles bedroom, and nothing comes up. Absolutely. That's so strange. I'm glad that we caught it on stream, though. Nickname Stinky does not suit my dignity, mother. <laughs> Looks and walks away to lick bum. Mother, mother, my ass is dirty. I must lick it. Maybe we just have some kind of secret, eh? Hey, FF, how are you doing? Yeah, maybe we discovered some kind of secret? I don't know. Just press the view when you're bored. <laughs> Fuck! Greg's a nap with Susan. How many Oh dear. I don't think you could buy him off. Right. Attempt number 20. Wonder what happens when you get to attempt number 69. I wonder if anything comes up. Wait, is, where is the princess? Where is the birthday birthday lady? For her birthday lady activities. Hey, birthday lady! Hello! Hello, birthday lady! Hello! Hello, birthday! Where's your hat gone, ma'am? Where's your hat gone? She's powdering her nose. Did you need to go poo? Who's who? Come here! Come here! She, her nose is dribbling. She is having, oh, she's just having the best day. Oh, and we're gone. We're gone again. Oh, thank you, Rooks. Would you say they were moments? I'm going to wait until Breed gets back and uh, we'll do her cake as well. Hello. Hi. Hi there. Oh, hello, Snuggles. <laughs> Feeling suitably snuggly. Do you want to take your pumpkin off? Ma'am, come back. Oh, she fucking loves this bed! Oh, she... Ah! She cannot wait to get in it. Let's change this over to... Just Jan. Yeah, thank you again to Udi. Thank you, Udi. This stream is sponsored by Udi. Um, so you can go to go to the link in the chat and if you want to buy anything you get 35 pounds off 35 dollars or 35 euros off a pet bed or an Odie. Mm. she is a very a very happy lady with it hang on I'm covering up her head before she was just sleeping she was just sleeping on some blankets on the floor and now she's a very cozy chilled out lady very chill avocado lady. Yeah, she likes to spread out as well. Who could go? <laughs> and we do have a do have a cake. Do have a cake. Without even changing your diet. <laughs> oh dear. Thirty-five pounds. 
You can use code Captain Battletail and you don't even have to change your change your diet. Yes, the bed is new today. It came ten minutes before stream. So just before stream, I was like hurriedly putting it together because I wanted to I really wanted to um gift it to her for her birthday. Or, you know, Udi gifted it to us for her birthday. Um and uh, sponsored the stream for her birthday. So I was like I was, I was hoping it was going to come in time because I didn't want to have to put it off for her. Uh, because obviously I'm away next week. I'm on um, on holiday uh, next week. So I didn't want to have to put it off for when we came back. Oh, dog. It needs to be advertised more. Yes, you can also use uh, my affiliate link on Amazon, which is below as well. Um, and it won't cost you any more. It'll just mean I get a... <laughs> Mr. Jeff Bezos will bless me with a little bit of, um, uh, what's it called? Commi commission? Is commission the right word? For, uh, encouraging you to buy from Amazon. A very happy lady. She's gonna sleep so much, because I'm gonna be keep like, because... You know, she wants to sleep now, and I'm gonna be like, Suzu, you've got a cake to eat! I've got a cake to eat, and I've got an activity for you as well! Hee 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 hee! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Rog, I was glad you were enjoying the, uh, the Jill of the Jungle. She might get overwhelmed. Nah, she's alright. She is happy as long as it's food. <laughs> I don't think she can get ever overwhelmed with stuff that's food. Oh, it actually... Actually smells really good. Can I eat this? Not for human consumption. That was really good though. <laughs> And so Badger sat there and wondered if the bedroom thing was a real secret ending or if it was some type of Ginny's marketing collaboration with Odie to sponsor their Dago bed. Dago. <laughs> okay, thank you. Yeah, imagine if we just went in there and there was a little dog bed just on the side, just and then a sponsored by Udi came up. Oh. I just, I do not like, there is nothing about it online. I'm looking up. Toilet Chronicles bedroom, there's no pictures for it. Like, there's, there's no information about it. Which ending am I missing? The bedroom ending, Nick. Did you ever get the bedroom ending? <laughs> Dag, oh. It's a dag. I, I had the gnome in my hand. And I walked through the door, and I saw a bedroom. But I can't find any information about it online. Is that an achievement on Steam? I don't think I got an achievement for it. Let's see. If not, it's not an ending. So I got one, two, four, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, and twelve. The true ending was the friends we made along the way, the friends we gnomed along the way. 
This is why the other guys dubbed your partner. Yeah, because we don't get to end, like... We don't get to leave with him. See, the bedroom... We just, we just, like, literally just walked into... Like, we just walked into a bedroom. Ah, thank you. You see, they're all the endings. He's actually waiting in the bedroom for you. N what, all laid out like that? Oh! I, I, oh, I can't get distracted. I can't get distracted. I can't get distracted. I'm gonna distract. Right, I'm gonna... You guys won't be able to see this. It's only a two-minute ending. You left the restroom without destroying the to destroying a toilet. Killed yourself. We got that one. Got that one as well. We destroyed a toilet. I want to have a look at the um. <laughs> I want to have a look at the sale. There doesn't seem to be a bedroom ending. I swear. Happy birthday, Suzu. The speed noodle. The goddess girl. The sassy princess. The baby dagger. The cushy stody sleeping Cushies. girl of the day. Cushy, what a cushy lady. Thank you, drug. Thank you. What a cushy lady. Yeah, I'm having a look through the uh, through the video that shows all of the all of the endings. And. I promise, I promise there was a there was a bedroom. I feel like I'm a crazy person. But you guys all saw that bedroom. Don't overthink it. I'm overthinking it. I'm overthinking it. I gotta watch my own VOD now. Oh Awkwardly intimate she does, because she uh, she whispers it to you. The sweet the sweet nothings. A hey, bread, welcome back! Fred, you're just in time for birthday cake! He took the gnome through. We waited for you. We did, we did, we did actually wait. See, I'm gonna make a clip. I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna make a clip of this. And then I'll post it in chat. The concentration on my face. I'm always really embarrassed when I watch these back because I'm like, just like, I, I'm always shrimped over and I'm always concentrating. Right, make it a clip. The, the, why does the clip thing never work for me? Hmm? Where is it? Is this mass hysteria? Let's call it the bedroom. Let's call it Bedroom Chronicles. Okay, for anyone looking back at the VOD, it's at 2 minutes 45... No, 2 hours 45 minutes and 21 seconds. So I don't think I'm going to be able to make a clip because the clip, the Twitch clip maker... The VOD's on, it's funny though, what do you... Always... Just always fucks with me. Always fucks with me, I never, like, it's always really glitchy. Just want to clip that. I think the orange party had is trying to escape. Yeah. Mm, I don't delete everything unused when I finish programming something. Should, but I worked on that some of the stuff. Worked on that stuff, so maybe the dev had the habit of leaving unused stuff in their programs. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. I don't, I don't know, I just... I'm so sussy! 
Okay, look, I admit it, the bedroom oh. was just part of the pro 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 for content that we forgot to remove at the last minute. We never thought a player would be stupid enough to manage to stumble into it. Happy now. So oh my god. Excellent. It did. Oh. No, I feel like I'm crazy. Two minutes. Two hours, 45 minutes through the VOD. Oh, I can copy the video URL so you guys can see it. There we go, that would work. The video URL. So you guys could, should be able to... There. Starting there, you can see the bedroom. So that I don't seem crazy. Because I can't get a clip of it. Right. Are you guys ready for a, a moment? A moment is being made. Hey, Bacon! Thank you! We definitely saw it. Good, good. I'm glad. I don't feel so crazy anymore. I don't feel so crazy. Suzu, as you can see, is very excited. Hang on, let me take off. Uh, let me take off the uh, the jump jumper for bedroom. Job. That bedroom is new to me. I'm glad you saw it, then, Nick. I'm glad you saw it. Let's put it in my socks. Oh, you got it, Rooks. You got your postcard. Yes. <laughs> Did it just come today? Oh, I'm so I'm very pleased. Take it out of its wrapping. Take for all of you to view. Bogey is she going to get it all over her bed? Quite possibly. Is there anything I can give it to her in? Absolutely not. Oh. Am I going to get given a plate? A blanket? Oh. That's a good idea, Greg.
Do you think I could have a? Do you think I could have like a um a white fur bed, please? Greg, you think I could have a little white fur bed, uh, bed please? Uh, no, like um like a rag and a little bit of a. She ate that like a. She ate that like a gremlin! <laughs> I don't know what I expected. Why did I expect any different? <laughs> Why didn't she eat it like that? <laughs> oh my god. She reclines happy and repay. Oh, I had just. Oh, she didn't even chew it. She didn't even chew it. <laughs> you listen. You can sneeze now. Best day ever. If you got the sneezing, then let me get the thing to clean you up. Hmm? Goodness sake! At least, uh, at least now I can uh, review the Udi bed's cleanness. Uh, can confirm, very easy to clean. Very easy to clean. <laughs> Thank you, mother, for the decorative sustenance. I must insist you stop fussing over crumbs and my eating <laughs> habits. I am a lady and not a gremlin. Now, if you'll excuse me, food comma commencing in T minus yeah. five. Susan. So much. Mullum still got lum cake and swap Matisse. <laughs> blam. Blam, blam. Thank you, bananas. Oh, Rug. No, you have a good appointment. You have a really good appointment. Oh, Rug, you're so sweet. Thank you so Thank you, Rug, for being here. Thank you. It was so lovely to see you today. Thank you. Oh, dear. You missed the moment! Bread! I saved that moment for you! God, I just hope she doesn't vomit it. I hope she doesn't vomit it back. What's with her dog? She is, uh, it's her birthday. It's her birthday and she just hawked her cake, so, um... <laughs> hopefully she's uh, hopefully she's happy! <laughs> oh, oh, bread, no! I can't believe it. I can't believe it! Kaga 200 Braid, giver of sustenance, braid. elicitor of salivation, provider of carbohydrates, 
Satisfier of hunger. Delicious braid. Now where is the cake? <laughs> oh, thank you! It's my party and I'll hawk if I want to. I've got another, um... I've got another activity for her as well. This is like, it's her birthday and I'm just, I'm like, Here Suzu, here's more, par here's more party things that you get to do. So remember, we did, we did get her this for her birthday. She's probably got, I just pull out another cake. Here's another moment for you, bread. All right, let's try and give us some easy ones and some hard ones, shall we? Maybe feed her a hobnob. I'm not sure their dog's safe. I'm not sure, not sure there's a dog safe. Gosh, she's, don't overfeed your dogs, by the way. This is a one-off. She does not usually get fed this much. Um, oh, these are fit. She does not usually get fed this much. And she has had her other food adjusted. There are, yeah, I've got, I'm doing normal treats, don't worry. I'm doing a mixture. So she can sniff them out. Her face. Just, just like treats. Am I getting more, mother? More? Yeah, let that, let that food go down, okay? Hello. Hey, Gobble. Oh, wait, look. Wait. Come on, see bed? Bed? I am not listening. I do not listen to you. Nearly. Go on, bed. Ah, get it. Ah, ah, Not awake. Go on. Go, Susie. Bed. Oh, bed. Oh, yes. Good job. Wait. Good girl. Yes. Oh, this is really interesting, actually. This is really interesting to see whether she can figure it out. Oh, did she get one? I think she got one. What a clever girl, good girl. Yeah, she's a smart lady, isn't she? Has she given up? Watch this for hours. <laughs> Watching one of the most highly intelligent animals on the planet. Just Quest. Here we see the birthday Suzu solving a tasty puzzle snack off and enjoying a hawking a whole birthday cupcake. <laughs> yeah. Okay, thank you. Oh, we're having to get up for this one. Oh, it's getting tricky. in intense gamer mode right now. It's like when you lean forwards. <laughs> okay. 
are you watching esports right now? Did she get one? Susie, your large body's in the way. Breed! I will see you later. You know, you have a you have a lovely day. I'm sorry you missed the I'm sorry you missed the moment. I hope maybe maybe when you go on your PC it might turn up. Maybe. Does she want a tip or would that be back to you? <laughs> yeah, Suze, go up those uh go up those stairs and you'll find Roger Wilco. She's got a chat stance, yeah. I don't think she's quite figured out that she needs to move, so that she needs to move them into the holes and then move them back. <laughs> Drunk. I will see you soon. You have a wonderful sleep. I will see you not next Monday, but the Monday after. Have a wonderful, wonderful sleep. And I wonder if by the end of the end of the VOD she would have gotten the treat. What? Do you want help? She's looking at me as if Mother, Mother, I need aid. moving them pretty well. Pretty well down. She just hasn't quite gotten her head that she needs to flip. Makes a dog play all the games. Yeah, this is now um this is now my new let's play. The dog will be playing. She does need the dogs. You need a hand? Yeah, we come to ask mummy for help. All right, all right. I'll come in and help. Come on. Come Yeah, she's asking for the walkthrough. She's asking for me to back seat. Come on, Suze. Thank you. 
heard a little poot. A little poot. Go on, take it. Can I have them? <laughs> Check to see whether Sierra made this. I put two more in there just to let it work for it a bit more. This uh, this puzzle is for intermediate. Intermediate. She's done puzzles before, which is why I thought, you know, we won't get the easiest. Realize she's she full of cake and doesn't care about treats. She always cares about treats. She always does. That's the um, that's the beauty of her is that she never quite gets full of food. Susu got soft locked. There, you got it, good job! Where do you get dog puzzles from? Oh, you can get them from Amazon. You can get them from pet stores. Um, lots of lots of places have dog puzzles. So the uh, the first uh, kind of puzzly puzzle one we had, we had um, the snuffle mat. And uh, that's that's just, uh, you just type in snuffle mat and then, um, what is this one called? This is called the dog hide and slide. <laughs> dog hide and slide, so they gotta, you, you hide it and they slide it. Uh, you can get other ones where the dog has to tip, tip it to, um, uh, like tip over the containers and get the treats out of it. Uh, there's also this thing called a wobbler, where they have to wobble, it's a, like a, you know, weebles wobble, but they don't fall down, it's weighted at the bottom. So she can't tip it over, but she has to wobble it so that then the treats fall out of it. So, uh, she put, has to push it around. And uh, that one is, the brand of that one is Kong, uh, which is also you can buy these little rubber things that you can pack their food into. And it's kind of a bit of a bit more of a puzzle to get out. So we um, were doing that for a breakfast and dinner where we would get her food. We would soak her food in water and then we would put it in these rubber um, containers, put it in the freezer, and then she would have to chew it to get it out so it was a bit of a kind of a bit of a puzzle with her but then she would get over frustrated and that's what kind of exacerbated the uh, food aggression so she's not allowed those until she can learn to behave so we're food uh, hand feeding her out of those now yeah mm. yeah you can't i'm allergic to peanut butter so i can't put peanut butter in them but you can put peanut butter in there and you can freeze the peanut butter too um we usually put cream cheese on the outside yeah, she is a peanut butter free dog. Peanut butter free dog. I can't have her. Can't have her licking me and <laughs> licking me and killing me. Yeah. Oh, you such a happy lady. Have you had the best day? Have you had the best? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm so I I'm so happy that she's happy. You know, I I feel like. She's got, you know, she's she's got a lot to work on, and obviously we're not fully kind of, you know, she's got a lot of work on, and there's lots of uh, difficult moments with her, and uh, moments where you're worried about her, and you know, recently we had her at the vet because she managed to get stung by a wasp, um, but I don't know, seeing her little happy face and seeing her comfy and cozy and, you know. All happy and safe makes me feel, um, I don't know whether she could walk or whether she'd be waddling lost. She just ate that whole cake. I thought she'd chew it. I thought she'd chew it. Not just, like, you know how pelicans just put the, just gobble the whole thing down. I, I feel very lucky to have her. I feel very lucky to, I did, you know, I don't want to say have her because it feels, you know, I feel lucky to, for her to have kind of, chosen. Well, I, you know, she didn't choose us. We did choose her. Didn't get much say in the matter. Oh, do you not want it on your bed anymore? Yeah. Down there. Yeah. Like the first child, the first dog is a lot more stressful since you have no experience. Yeah, like I don't think we really needed to take it to the vets. 
Uh, like we didn't go need to go to the emergency vets for her wasp sting. We could probably just waited until morning. But obviously, I don't, you know, I don't know when the dog's got a swollen uh, throat and everywhere online is like ah, you know, she's, she's gonna die. It's um. Hello. Hi. I know you're not dead. Go back to your bed though, fam. I don't have any more snacks for you. You are done with snacks. You are. D-O-N. Done with snacks. Yeah. Oh. Thank you for the cuddles. Oh, yeah. Snello. Yeah, she was just... She was just vibing and I looked... <laughs> you just... <laughs> I looked through the house. Oh. Simon! Everyone's bouncing I had a great shit this morning, Simon. Like, jet, like a really nice, smooth, solid one. Hi. Yeah, I feel very, very lucky to be able to have her. And I'm very, very thankful for the opportunity uh, that streaming in you guys have given me to be able to be able to have her. She, I said from, like, you know, everyone, everyone always asked what I wanted to do. And I was like, oh, I just want a dog. You know, I was just, oh, I just want a dog. And uh, I've been saying that for since like since day one on Twitch. That was my goal was to be able to be able to be in a position where I could get a dog. And um, you can see a little paw. She's checking for snacks. She's on the snack hunt. And I I feel very very lucky to be able to have her. And hi, <laughs> she's an absolute sweet angel baby. And when I see her happy, it Jenny like oh. Like when she took her first car ride and she actually got into the car, I think I cried. I think our neighbors saw, saw me just sobbing that she got in the car. Um, and thinking, you know, I don't know, thinking that like six months ago she didn't have a home and she was like essentially on the streets, it makes me makes me very um i don't know emotional to think that i'm so pleased that she gets to be happy now and i'm so pleased that she gets to be that she feels like she can be excited for things and she can you know she she can be excited for food and you know if she's got any problems we'll try and work through them with her and i feel i feel very lucky to have such a, a special little lady that now I get to I get to see Happy. She doesn't like cars. She uh, she came to us with a really big fear of cars. Um, she was absolutely mortified of them. Wouldn't like it meant that we couldn't leave 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 the home because you know if a car went past, she would be absolutely fucking terrified. Um, she wouldn't get in the car. She wouldn't go near my car, uh, which obviously made it really difficult because. Um, uh, can't take her anywhere and can't um can't get her out of the house and she's just gradually really trusted us and let us let us push her to do them you know and now she quite enjoys car rides i think i th i think she quite enjoys them she watches out the window um and there's like a little bit of netting so me and greg are in the front seat she's in the back seat and there's a little bit of netting in between us and she hooks her head over the netting like a little head hammock so she can see out the front and uh, yeah, no, for like weeks we were really struggling to get her in the car and a lot of people just say just pick them up and put them in the car but she doesn't want us to pick her up and put her in the car because she's afraid of the car so obviously us trying to force her into the car she's not not liking it. Atom. And happy birthday, Susie. Atom, thank, thank you very much, thank you. Yeah, and eventually, eventually she did, she got in there herself. And I, I just, I had a little sobby. It adopted into a loving house with XPs and GI issues. Honestly, when she shit, when she's got the shits, we've all got the shits. Learned that she loves cars. Good job. She's a really big fan of Lightning McQueen. And she likes watching, um, she likes watching birds on, um, 
She likes watching birds on uh, what's this? Uh, like the like the TV and stuff. How do I know it's her birthday if she was homeless? Um, she, uh, I think she was microchipped, um, which told us her birthday. So she was homeless, but she was microchipped. She was found, and the person who had her microchip presumably did not want her back. So um, yeah, she did. She did come with her birthday deets. So we're very lucky to know when her birthday is, I think. Because not everyone gets it kind of as accurate. You know, you kind of, you do an adoption, adoption day that, um, oh, that's their kind of symbolic birthday. But has, we did, we did get her actual birthday, um, which we were, I was very pleased about. Because, uh, so she was originally a racing greyhound and, um, she never got to the track. Well, we think she never got to the track uh, because she's too young to have gotten and um, to have uh, had a career and ended. Also, she's very thin. So she's not... Um, you see a lot of racing greyhounds and they are thick. They are like... They are muscle... Like, they are thick. Whereas you look at her and she's just, you know... It doesn't have any of that muscle definition. So we don't think she ever got to the track. It seems like she might have been thrown out uh, for either being not too, not quick enough, not good enough, um, you know, what, whatever reason that she, she got, um, she got thrown out for. And uh, I don't think, I think she got up a dog. I think she got that dumpy, but she, <laughs> she's not got like that massive thick mutter, like neck that you see the racing greyhounds. And then um, she got thrown out and she was found on the streets. And uh, because she's a racing greyhound, or it was bred to be a racing greyhound, she came with a, she had her original racing microchip, which told us all of her, like, details, but not, obviously they didn't tell us who originally owned them or whatever. Um, it's just like the Simpsons. <laughs> yeah, she is. Yeah, she's a failed racing greyhound who became homeless, only to be adopted by a kindly family. Oh, Suzu, please, no. Ma'am, this is a sponsored stream, ma'am. <laughs> yeah, we say her ears are like little Yoda ears. Never knew my cat's exact birthday because the owners of their mum. Oh, we're away the week. <laughs> so they had no idea. My first cat was a street girl when the shelter found her, so we didn't know her birthday. Did you just, uh, did you... No, I guess, so my, my parents adopted a cat and we knew he was nine months old when we adopted him, so we kind of just worked. We were like, well, his birthday's about three months in the future. Yeah, so we've got kind of no idea when she was thrown out. It is quite possible because of her age and when we got her that she might have gotten might have been assessed pre-training or whatever and then thrown out um, as kind of not good enough. My eldest sister had a number of racing greyhounds from rescues. None of them... Oh, one of them you could tell wasn't a motivated winner. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, a little lazy one. Oh. One was three-legged because she broke her leg due to being so eager. What a baby! Oh, she's really, she's really having at that bum. No, you, you do you, Suze. Don't let me, don't let me put you off. Don't let me put you off. Oh. Cutie, We celebrate her gotcha day. Oh, she looks ashamed because she hawked her whole cake and didn't chew it. And snatched it. She didn't only hawk it. She snatched it. You know, I had this beautiful image in my mind that I was going to present her with this cake and she was going to eat it lovingly from my hands. I don't know why I thought that. Obviously, high value treat. Dog with slight, you know, uh, resource guarding. Obviously, she's going to snatch it for me. Big brain here didn't really put that together. I was like, oh, it's going to be beautiful. I'm going to be singing her happy birthday while she takes this cake lovingly from my hands and eats it. No. <laughs> yeah, she did the old snatch and grab. At least I can vouch now for the Udi's bed's cleanability. It is easy to clean. 
um because i did it so i bought the uh, cake with the bright pink icing because i was like that's cute that looks very birthday very fun uh didn't really think of oh bright pink icing that might stain maybe i should have gotten the white icing expectation versus reality I thought it was going to be a beautiful moment, you know. I thought I was going to cry because, you know, I was you know, so, so emotional during that moment. And she's just like, no, I'm a goblin. Sorry, mum. Sorry. Don't get emotional. Yeah. When we adopted my current two cats, the rescue agency was so skittish about telling me the cat's very normal behavior. They had so many people really return the cats for the dumbest reasons. I feel like cats can't do much wrong, though. <laughs> you know, like... I guess, like, scratch furniture. Turns out dogs aren't so sentimental. No, she's just happy. She's just happy in her bed now. Uh, we don't know if the previous owner got any, like, any, any, any problems from throwing her out. I'm not sure. Um, we didn't get that much information from, like, her previous life. Uh, all we got told was that she was a stray, but she was bred to be a racer so uh we didn't get we didn't get any information about where she was found uh what she was doing <laughs> they just don't demonstrate it like people do no they demonstrate by snatching cake oh my tabby possum what a baby name he used to scream and scream at night until he came and turned on the kitchen light. Oh, scared of eating in the dark. We thought she might be scared of the dark a little bit. So we have, um, I don't know. You probably can't see. I've got like a little candle, like an electric candle. Returned cats for not liking car rides. Why? Why? I've never met a cat that enjoyed a car ride either. Yeah! The only time they get car rides is when they're being taken to the vet. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we've, um... My parents adopted their cats. And I remember the first cat that we got... He, uh... He farted everywhere. But he didn't, um... He didn't really have any strange behaviours? I can't think of any. He was quite a chonker. <laughs> He was quite a, he was quite a food motivated cat. He was a bit of a chonker. Um, but that was kind of the only quirky behavior that I can think about him. Um, the next cat they got, uh, he was, he's very sweet, but gets very angry at people touching his stomach. Yeah, you know, like he's very overly affectionate. And then he rolls onto his stomach and he's like, you know, rub me, rub me. And then bites you and you do. And you're just like, how have the dog of farts been today? I I gave her her cake and then I was down there doing the um the the snack the snack puzzle box Shashka and then I, all I could hear was pfft, pfft, pfft. That's the worst when the the room is dead silent and you just hear pfft. and you just you know it's a silent but deadly one. Hmm. Loves, I will see you later. No, thank you so much. Like, I can't thank you guys enough for, um, I, like, I, I just can't thank you enough for wanting to share her birthday with me. You know, like, I, oh, this is where I'll stop crying. No, I felt, I felt that go, um, <laughs> I, like, I'm so pleased that she is, I don't know, you know, she, she she's so kind of well-liked. <laughs> I'm so pleased that she, I don't know. I'm so pleased that she gets the opportunity to be cozy and have so much, have so much kind of love directed towards her, you know? <laughs> Loss, have a nice, <laughs> have a nice day at work. Thank you for making me cry, Loss. Yeah. Oh dear. Mm. We did uh, when we first got Suze. 
first, you know, first dog, we were like, oh my God, have we made the wrong decision? You know, I, we, we thought we'd made the worst decision because she just, she was so frightened of everything. And we were like, are we the wrong people to have her? Suzu is a sweet baby angel owned by an pair of angel owners, CBT angel. <laughs> Rix, you say that. You say that just as I'm saying that I thought we made a terrible mistake. Rix, <laughs> thank you. No, we, uh, we, we did think that, oh God, we've made a terrible mistake. We thought we weren't the right owners for her. You know, it wasn't, wasn't necessarily that she wasn't the right dog for us. Um, we thought we weren't really... We, I, I was worried we were gonna, we were putting her through more than you know. We weren't, we weren't equipped to help her uh, in a way that um, she needed. And her high, high prey drive is, is, it's gotten a lot better. But obviously, um, she's been bred to have a high, high prey drive as a greyhound. You know, to go do the racing, um, and that made, made things quite difficult. But. She has improved so, so quickly, and she is so receptive, and it's, she, try, she tries her best, <laughs> you know, she tries her best, and I am so very pleased that we, you know, stuck, you know, stuck with it, and um, I, I, I'm pleased that she stuck with us as well, you know, like she was receptive and she was wanting to try her best and improve and I just, I hope that we can give her the best life that she get, you know, she can have, you know, I, I want her to not feel worried about things anymore. Mmm. Feels so bad taking my two to the vet for the first time after getting them. Oh, they thought the calm and the yeah, edible. She was the same. She was. The... She thought calm and bye bye. She thought car. Like, I think that's also why she was afraid of. She was afraid of leaving the house because she thought leaving house now means she's going away, and it's building the trust that it doesn't mean bye bye. It means we're gonna come back home, and. Uh... You know, when we would go out uh, the first couple of times, uh, you know, just we would go out for like 20 minutes to to try and make sure that she wouldn't get separation anxiety because we don't want her being anxious. We don't want her being worried that we're not going to come home. And it's her getting used to us leaving doesn't mean that we're leaving forever. We're not just, you know, going away. Oh, oh you guys are so sweet. Thank you. Yeah, it's... Uh... <laughs> what are you looking at, stinker? You can't see me. No, you guys can just see me sobbing. Yeah. Oh, it's a baby. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of hard bits and a lot of bits where you're like... Oh, you know. I just, you know, I wish she would... I wish she wouldn't be so worried. You know, I wish she wouldn't be so worried. Because you're like, there's nothing to be worried about. Don't worry about it. But obviously she's so, so scared. And uh, when, she, when she got bit... Uh, stung by the wasp you know the first thing that she wanted was a cuddle that's the first thing she wanted she got stung by that wasp and she was so unhappy she was whining and we did we hadn't realized she'd been stung by a wasp she was turning around in circles and circles and you know getting really distressed so i crouched down and she came over hooked her head on my shoulder and just stood there for a cuddle Like, yeah, she did want to run and eat some acorns as well, but that's besides the point. Oh, Greg, I was trying to be sweet. She just wanted a cuddle. Yeah, you can't tell them that you're just going to go on vacation and you'll be back, right? Hey, vampire, good evening. It's late for you. Oh, it's a big yawn. Hey? Are you happy? Oh, she's really happy. Yeah, she just wanted a cuddle. She's gotten very, very cuddly. Haven't you? Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, you tired now. Oh, bless you. Bless you. Oh, hello. Hi. See, I say she's going to be sweet and now she's going to turn into a little bit of a ratty lady, aren't you? 
Yeah, you like, oh, mommy, pay attention to me, mommy. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, with greyhounds, when they uh, get excited or they see something they like, and so you'll find it when she looks at uh, looks at either me or Greg, she'll sit there and she'll chatter her teeth. She'll sit there and she'll chatter her teeth because she's so excited. Oh, we look up bum again. Or oh, and she sits there and she's. Like, and puffs her cheeks out. Bam. Just got home for work. Had a wish, Suzu, a happy doggo day. Thank you so much. Thank you. You big sweetie. No, you have a wonderful night's sleep. Thank you. Yeah, at last. Go on. Go on. Get going. Thank you so much for being here. No, it really does make me, um, I feel, I feel very grateful. And it makes me, uh, very, uh, grateful for the community. That you guys, you're just so, you're so kind of all, you're like, you're so kind to, uh, so kind, I'm so, like, I don't know, it makes, makes me, <laughs> you're so kind, and it's always a joy to, sh like, to, I'm so glad I shared it with you, you know, it's, it's, it's one, one thing, yeah, yeah, I'm so, no, your evil monsters are, sorry, sorry, <laughs> Yeah, I feel very, um, very grateful for all of you, and, uh, yeah. Like, uh, whenever we were having a, so obviously I didn't tell you about her for a couple of weeks when we had her. Whenever we were having a really awful day, or it was really difficult, uh, coming on stream always made me feel better. And, uh, I could hear, Brooks! <laughs> Thank you! Thank you so much. For, thank you very much for gifting five subs to the community. <laughs> thank you. Space Bunny, Void, Jin, Platform, Adrian. Welcome to the weenies. Thank you so much, Rooks. Gotta get them. Gotta get them while they're hot. Thank you. Be the big comfort, sir, while you scream through your, your horror games next. Yeah, but thank you, Greg. Yeah, that's actually a good point. Let me wipe away my tears. I gotta... I got some plug in to do. <laughs> but don't forget, we will be having Spook Temba. Spook Temba. Spooktober. Temba. Spooktober. Next month. AKA. Not next week because I'm on holiday. The week after. And we will be starting Resident Evil Village, uh, Sanua's Sacrifice, and on Wednesday we'll be playing Seventh Guest. Snail Toba, spooky Snail Toba. So, Suzu will hopefully have a nice oody bed while I'm screaming for all the spooks. Happy birthday, Buraza! Oh my God, you two, <gasps> Buraza! You're the same age as Buraza. No, you're the same age as her. Thank you so much for two years. That's special, isn't it? You're the same age. Think when she was being birthed, you... <laughs> you were here. Borazar, thank you so much. Thank you so much for two years, 24 months. Yeah. It's her second birthday. Yeah, Zen and I thought you did. I... Sanua's sacrifice. I thought you'd enjoy that one. So we will be having our scare alerts on. There will be plenty of spooks. I'll be being jump scared all the way through. I'm really worried that Resident Evil Village is going to be too scary for me. I, I know I'm really concerned. <laughs> I'm really concerned that it's going to be too spooky. Uh, Resident Evil Village on Mondays and Fridays. Sunua's sacrifice on Tuesday. Which I know Zenon. I know Zenon's been mentioning for a while. So finally. And then on Wednesday we'll be playing Seventh Guest. This will be fun. <laughs> be great. So I'll be back. I'll be back crying. Uh, but for a different different reason. Yeah, for a very different reason. I have to get back to work. Oh, have a wonderful, relaxing holiday, Badger Twilber. Love see you soon, Badger and fellow Weenies. Salute Korgatu105. Thank you 
so much. You have a wonderful, wonderful week. I will see you next Monday off. Monday, Monday next. 10. Okay, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Edible. Thank you. Thank you for 69 gift subs as well. Nice, nice, nice. Thank you so much, RK. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And Edible, welcome to the weenies. I hope you're having a lovely Friday Friday. Oh, you're going to do all the main Resident Evils for the Halloween season. Oh, you're playing four. Have you done Village? How scary? If so, how scary was it? Isn't scary, it's sexy. I know because of the big sexy vampire. Honestly, I think the big sexy vampire will be what's getting me through. Nice, nice, nice. No, I, uh, I take, <laughs> I take um, the, uh, this week off in October, the first week off every year. Um, but it is quite a nice little break before we get into Spooktober. Seven is scarier than eight. Okay, that's what I was hoping. I was hoping that I'd find a kind of good middle ground where I would not be too scared. She's a nicer person to chase you over some other villains. Exactly. Exactly. You know, so if I get if I get too scared, I can just look at the dumpy. <laughs> now feel better, right? Oh, Porazar. Thank you. That's so sweet of you to say. She did steal the cake, though. I did give her a cake, and I was imagining this really beautiful, nice moment, and she was just like, no, this is my cake. This isn't my cake, and I'm taking it. Looking forward to... <laughs> Boopers. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, horror game training montage. Yeah, I'm going to be playing Amnesia while you guys are watching. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I'll just look at Mummy. D uh, is it Dimit? Dimit? Uh, I've never heard anyone say it out loud. I've always read it, and I've always just kind of tried to avoid saying it. It's one of those words. Uh, Dimit? Dimitres? Dimitrescu? Right? Dimit? D Dimit? Dim? Dim? Yeah. Yeah. It will be a lot of fun. And then after that, November. We will be starting Hitman in November, Hitman 3. I can re reveal sl sl our uh, schedule slightly. Um, we will be going into Hitman in November. And then in December, we have a very special, very special streams, uh, very special Christmas streams where we will be doing original hardware. Uh, you know, I've hinted at the game, you know, I won't reveal it yet. Uh, <laughs> But again, I think it's going to be one that Zenon likes. She says it in the game. Good, good. Just say Lady D. Dominatrix. So it's not Dominatrix. Uh, we've played Hitman 2. Yeah, it's Gwen. <laughs> it's Gwen on original hardware. That's what we're going to be playing. <laughs> Dimitrescu. Dimitrescu. It's cute. Bathtub's tag when you play. <laughs> yeah, we'll be playing original hardware, and then I think we, we'll be running another game, but I can't remember what that is. And we've got a, a special non-gaming stream as well planned for in between Christmas and New Year. I know that seems way, way away, but um, it will be some some fun. <laughs> Elf bowling. The perfect game for the Christmas season. Is that a retro one, Haley? Yeah, so next month is the big Spooktober extravaganza. November will be nice, relaxing. Ah, it's not a Christmas. It's, I swear, it's not, it's not cooking. It's not cooking. I don't know if that might be more of a disappointment that it's not going to be cooking. What non-gaming activity is there? Uh, I don't know whether... Maybe I can give you a little hint. Um... It's something that people like doing in between Christmas and New Year. You tend to get it for Christmas and then do it in between Christmas and New Year. Complete it. Um, just trying to think of a, a different way to say it. And it is related to one of the games that we... 
is related to one of the games <laughs> that we played last year. Quite an important game that we played last year. A 1,000 piece puzzle. <laughs> you are, you are clo closer than Yak. You're closer than Yak, definitely. Dickens Christmas. Honestly, I am... Um, there was like a book, Dickens Christmas, and I was I was very tempted by it. What are we gonna do without seeing egg yolks spread all over your kitchen floor, <laughs> kitchen counter and floor? I should make those um jelly eggs again. Hide the sausage. I don't. I don't want to know. I don't. I don't want to know what hide the sausage is. Oh, I have some bits. Oh. <laughs> Here you go for Suzu. Don't eat them too. They're not treatos. <laughs> She's absolutely. She's absolutely dead to the world, Banana. She's, she is, you know, after you eat Christmas dinner, that is what she is experiencing right now. She is full, she is large, and she is, she's like, she's so, she's, she's reached Nirvana, I think. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, family tried goose for Christmas, but all they want is roast pork. I guess you could cook the goose and then... Geese are quite big. They're not quite big. We did a... Uh, I don't know what we're going to do for Christmas. I'm already asking Greg. I'm like, Greg, what do you want for Christmas this year? She's all tuckered out. She's going to be... On her walk, she's going to be... Like, waddling, waddling. She's going to be... I'm just glad she didn't vomit up that cake. Because she started... Like, I don't know if you probably didn't notice on camera. She started going... Because <laughs> she'd obviously not chewed it. Because she's stupid. And I'm stupid for expecting her to have chewed it, and I should have cut it up for her. And that's on me. That's that that one's on me. I should have cut it up for her. I should have made her eat it slower. But in my mind, I was imagining a Disney princess moment, like when Snow White feeds the birds. That's what I. That's the kind of thing was I was imagining, and I instead got. Yeah, it was a it was a learning experience for all involved. Oh, Tetsu. Oh, no. All I want for Christmas is you. I hate that. It's my least favorite Christmas song. It's my it's my absolute least favorite. Thank you for bringing us back on brand. Don't tell Udi this is my brand. <laughs> Udi, we're very, very wholesome here. I swear. responsible for anything that's being said in chat right now. I'm absolutely absorbed into my coffee. Just if I close my eyes. If I close my eyes, there's nothing, there's nothing wrong. It's an educational stream. Can't wait for her to have a merry elf costume. Oh, I do need a. Now she's got a. She's got a pumpkin Halloween costume. Gotta get her like a, a little elf costume too. Every day's a school day. I did. Um, we were questioning whether all sphincters were the same size. I remember. I remember. <laughs> I remember. I remember us talking about that maybe year, like years ago. It feels like now. And it like sphincters are like a muscle. They do. Um, they do come in different sizes. What's pray, Greg? What's that supposed to do, hmm? <laughs> what was that supposed to do, hmm? Pray for Suzu. We just, are we just praying now? Where I discussed it at length. Oh. Oh, were you trying to link the YouTube video, Greg? Where I discussed it at length. Need a Santa badger costume and a Sudo reindeer. Oh my god, yes! She looks exactly like a little reindeer. She does. We got a new Christmas stockings. I just ordered some. And they've got little reindeer on them because they look like her. Yeah. <laughs> it's possible for it to be negative. Oh, the Grinch Max! Oh, 
Greg would have to be the Grinch. Sorry, Greg. Sorry. I think I'd some. I can. Uh, I think I do a fairly good Jim Carrey though. Sometimes I can make my um. You know, he has that really big smile. Sometimes I can make my face do that. I couldn't. I. I couldn't guarantee that I'm able to do it now though. Haley Fat. Hey, Brad! Welcome back. Look who is absolutely pooped. We're leaving. Everyone, everyone said they leave, Brad. It's like after a party, everyone's like, "Bye, Badger. Bye. Thank you for the party." She is a little snoozy lady. Little snoozy lady. Add Haley's back to the room. You plimps get out, yeah. I'm afraid you have to leave now, the party's over. Guys, the police are here, the party's over. <laughs> party's over, we gotta get out! We gotta get out! I'm staying! Oh my gosh, I am away next week, aren't I? Oh my goodness. I'll sleep next to the bins. Slumber party! The best part of the party is always the, um... Always the ending, anyway. This isn't a raid. Too much to drink, so I'm afraid I'll have to leave and drive home. Wait, no! No driving when you're drunk! No drink driving! No farting in people's faces. <laughs> I think I do. No, I didn't fart in that face. I I farted in that this the general direction of that face. I'm just cleaning up after the party. It's gonna take a whole week. Honestly, my office is a absolute mess right now. There's gifts everywhere. There's tissue paper everywhere. Susan's had an absolute rager. He was a bath? Oh my god, no, Fog! What What was the drink? What was the butthole? What was the butthole? Yeah, I had a really nice time! Thank you guys for coming to the party. I had a really lovely time. I can't- I don't think I could have wished a birthday party to be any better. I had a really, really wonderful time. We cried. We laughed. We went to the toilet. We ordered it by saying, show me that butthole. Oh my gosh. Show me that butthole. You'd be very upset if they did, they, if the bartender that was working that night perhaps didn't know that that was a drink and they just followed through them. They were like, oh sure, yeah. <laughs> Come round back. No, I had a really nice time. Thank you guys. Thank you. I had like a butthole to sip. Please put that butthole on tab, on my tab. How much for a butthole? <laughs> you probably... <laughs> Want to know that about that bartender, <laughs> frankly? I've seen that happen. No, no, no. Oh my goodness. Is this how parties always end? But we just. Right. Go on, you can all leave now. You can, <laughs> you can all leave. Have the after, pa after party at the bar. Friend of mine I assumed his girlfriend who was a bartender at a different bar knew how to make the drink. No! She did not and was not pleased. Dango! Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Oh my god. You can't oh. Just go around asking bartenders to show me their butthole. Could you put an extra shot on my butthole? Almost kicked my friend out before I explained. I feel like if you invent a drink called butthole, you need to specify that it's this bar specific. 
It must have been a good bar. It must have been a good drink though if everyone was ordering it, even when they weren't at the same bar. Yeah, absolutely, Udi. Again, thank you so much for sponsoring. Sorry to, sorry to, thank you. Just after talking about buttholes, I do apologize that that's where that led into. Thank you so much for sponsoring Susie's birthday. She is in love with the bed, and I. I'm so very grateful that she gets to sleep in style now. I know this has become the butthole stream, but one more time, happy birthday, Suzu. Thank you so much, Adam. Thank you. Guys, thank you so much for being here for her birthday. Thank you so much to Udi for sponsoring this stream. Do check out the link in chat. It helps helps out. It helps Udi know that you enjoy the stream. Um, you can use code Captain Badgertail at checkout. They get a discount on Udi pet beds and Udi. Udi, 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 Udi's. Udi, 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 Udi. And I'm really pleased that I get to continue working with Udi because they are like. Just everything they touch is just great. <laughs> everything they touch is just great. Look at this little baby. She's so happy. See her eyes poke open. She's like, I'm baby. Are we like, I, I, I hope so, Zinnan. <laughs> Or else this will be the last time that Udi works for me. Thank you guys. Yeah, it'll be the last time that Udi works with me. <laughs> so I did genuinely love cocktail umbrellas as a kid. I just love that they were little mini umbrellas. <laughs> no, but a big like such like such such a big thank you guys. Thank you so much for being such a such a great community and just just being so, ah, uh, just so lovely and so welcoming to Dogi, to and being you know just so much fun to fun to do like to have, have a party with you know, and I won't remind you that I won't be here next week or Monday to Friday no badger, uh, but we will be back on the tenth I think the date is the tenth. Yeah, we'll be back on the tenth with Spooktober. Resident Evil 8 Village. Um, all our spooky alerts will be on. All of the spookums will be happening and now somebody will have a nice bed to sink into while I am screaming in the same room for them. With with them. With her. With that. Yes. All the words. Catch up with the VODs. Yeah! So instead of me, you can, you can watch VODs. You can watch any YouTube videos. I don't know if there will be a new one up next week. There might be. I don't know how how that that one's been. How that one's going. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. I will let you all go into the ever, um, rather than raiding. I think um, I think I got a lot of cleaning to do. A lot of cleaning. Some hydrating to do. I don't have. A, I haven't kept myself hydrated. I hope somebody else has. Thank you so so much, guys. Thank you. Oh, it's so much fun. I had such a lovely. I'm gonna go cry. I like. Thank you so much for making everything so much fun. And I will see you on the 10th. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you. Oh, I, f I like... I, it's like I'm on a phone call and I don't want to say goodbye. I don't want to I don't want to put down the phone. But no, I hope you all have a wonderful week. Don't, you know, make sure your bows are good. Save up all of the bow stories for me, please. Um, so that... <laughs> so that... I can hear them all. No, you hang up first. Thank you so much, guys. You know what I'll do? I'll turn myself off. Not that one. This one. I'll turn myself off. And the ending screen. The ending screen could just be just be Susie having a snoozy. Thank you so much, guys. I will see you on the 10th. You have just the most fantastic week. The fantastic weekend. Oh, be strange. I'll see you soon. And again, thank you so much, Udi. I love you, Udi. Thank you. Thank you so much, guys.